What is up, everyone? Welcome to Virtual Red Band number 316. Chill. Just going to be a chill episode today. Uh, was just going to hang out, you know? Uh, we had a good episode last night. Uh, we talked about Grand Theft Auto. Uh, before I get into that, though, I am drinking a Tito's and Orange. Very light on the uh, the orange uh, monster because I accidentally poured too much Tito's in. So this looks like straight vodka to me. Oh, vodka to me. Yep. That kind of sucks. Um, also, uh, if you live in Austin this Thursday, we got the secret show at Vulcan Gas Company. That starts at 730 is the pre-show. Uh, and then 8 o'clock is when the comedy starts. Uh, you get your tickets at BL Comedy. That's BigLaughComedy.com or BaconLettuceComedy.com. Uh, so you can get your tickets there. They're selling fast this week. This week should be good. There's a lot of comics in town. Uh, I believe Kirk Fox is going to try to jump on. And we just got a bunch of uh, people that are in town this week. So it should be a good one. Uh, that's Thursday. Also, I am wearing the re-release of the Death Squad hat, the McDonald's hat, McLucky hat. You can go to shopsquad.tv. There's the new Shop Squad. Uh, if you haven't been there yet, I had to redo the whole website. Uh, this hat's just too small. Uh, that's a small hat. You can get them in different sizes. Uh, so, uh, yeah. So you can go to shopsquad.tv. There you have all the shirts, news, mugs, stickers you got face masks that's a lot of a lot of people don't know that we have death squad face masks so if you want a face mask comes with a bunch of stickers and a patch uh you got that you got glow in the dark sh uh buttons uh you also got the new uh brody stevens limited edition shirt uh it's a shirt that i made for free when brody stevens passed and i gave it to all the family and friends of brody a lot of people wanted it, so I made a small amount of those and giving profits of that to uh, a charity that Brody's family wanted, uh, so uh, it goes to a good cause. And we got the new Death Squad mug, which is what I am drinking out of right now. We got that in orange and blue. Let's go to ShopSquad.tv for that. <clears throat> so, whoop. anyways, yesterday we talked about Grand Theft Auto and all the... All the problems it's having. They released a new remastered uh, pack. Uh, it is uh, got a lot of problems with it. Um, and we talked about that yesterday. Today, Janice has never played Grand Theft Auto. My girlfriend's never played Grand Theft Auto. And she wanted to play. Uh, she's been watching me watch all these reviews of it. And uh, she, she's like, you know what? I want to play that. So... I bought it, even though I didn't think I was going to buy it. Even though I already own the video games, all the I own Grand Theft Auto Three, Vice City. I own all the San Andres. I already own own them, but you know, finding them, hooking up an Xbox and all that crap does not seem like fun. So uh, I bought it, and uh, immediately uh, there was a couple things I noticed about it so if you're thinking about buying it i got it on the xbox series x the, the latest xbox and the, the number one thing i noticed was that uh it's really dark the whole game is just like really dark like i thought it was nighttime at one point and it was daytime um i think it's an hdr problem uh, you know, I think, I don't know if I read that on any of the reviews I've been reading online about it, but it seems like an HDR problem because the dark is dark and the light is light, but it just, it constantly looked like it was at night and then it started raining and, you know, I've seen the videos of the rain, how bad it is. And man, that rain does suck. You can't even see anything to begin with. Then you add like this bright white rain that looks like it's just raining snow or cum or something like that it lo looks like it's raining milk uh really bad i mean the graphics were fine like i think i like the new additions it looks better there's a lot of things missing though like there's no fog uh if you shoot a window in a car it doesn't shatter like it used to it just disappears so there's a lot of things there's a lot of issues with with it 
Now, uh, Janice moved on to Vice City because uh, she wanted to play that more than Grand Theft Auto 3. And that looks a lot better. It definitely looks a lot better. So uh, maybe that's just a problem with Grand Theft Auto 3. Uh, but Vice City looks better. Um, so we'll see. You know, I haven't really played it too much. I've been watching her play it, though. I don't think I re recommend it, though, at its current state. Uh, I don't think I would recommend it at all. But, you know, if you're just itching to play some old school Grand Theft Auto, sure. Hopefully they patch it up. Hopefully, you know, hopefully they spend the next six months tweaking it and fixing it and making it better. Because it has the potential to be good. Uh, like, I, I could see while playing it, like, hey, this does look a little refreshed. It looks a little new. I love Grand Theft Auto 3. I love Grand Theft Auto Vice City. You know, having it, like, have a new coat of paint on it I'm kind of down for and that's kind of what I was hoping for and right now it's just it's just too many problems but if they can patch it up maybe in six months it'll be worth it maybe in six months it will be like a $20 game also for all three you know who knows right now it's 60 bucks it's pretty broken uh it looked pretty bad uh so yeah there you go <clears throat> Red Bomb it bombed pretty hard yesterday. Oh, yeah, you did stand-up yesterday. Grand Theft Auto 2, bitch. Yeah, I have actually Grand Theft Auto 1. I think it was PlayStation 1 I got it on, and I got it place, uh, and I got Grand Theft Auto 2. I think that was PlayStation also, right? Or was it PlayStation 2? I can't remember. But, I, I, yeah, it's a totally different game. It was almost like Spy Hunter. I don't know if you guys ever seen Grand Theft Auto 1 or 2. It, it looked like Spy Hunter. You remember the game Spy Hunter? It was like a, uh, like you're looking down at a car and whatever. Um, thanks to Blue Chew. Uh, yeah, Red Bum joined us last night. He did some stand up comedy. If you guys also, we did stand up comedy or we had a stand up comedy show last night. It was pretty fun. Maybe we'll do that again tonight. I don't know. Uh, but that was a lot of fun. Uh, Let's see that hair, bro. I'm getting a hard on. Oh, thanks. Do you ever go up during Joe's shows? Um, I used to open up for Joe. I haven't, I don't really do it much lately. Uh, I think one of the big weird things is that me and Joe, especially since I pretty much grew up as Joe, as uh, like teaching me the ropes of stand up, I mean, he was pretty much my, my master growing up. I think our material is just very similar, you know. So. I know when we used to go up all the time, it was like we both had the same jokes all the time. I don't really go up on Joe's shows anymore. I mean, I'll go, I'll, I'll hang out with Joe at the show, but I usually don't go up. Uh, I think, it, you know, he usually has Tony and William and Hans and David go up now, and that's fine. Uh, I think uh, we just have very similar styles and comedy. Like, we talk about the same shit, pretty much. <clears throat> uh, Red Band, you used the Quest 2. I thought you tried it and didn't like it. No, I like the Quest 2. Uh, Janice is the one that usually uses it. Uh, I use the Valve Index, but we have a Quest 2 in the other room. Uh, it's great. It's a great... Uh, I recommend that for people that want to start VR because it's a, it's a good start. You know, like, if you enjoy doing VR while you're playing it, you can... Uh, buy a, a laptop or a computer and plug it into a computer and it upgrades it to like a high-end VR headset. Or you can just, you know, not use a computer and it's still a lot of fun. I recommend it. There's also a game that recently came out on it. Uh, Medal of Honor? Is that, why does that sound wrong? Is it Medal of Honor? It's like a first-person shooter World War II game that just came out. I think it's called Medal of Honor. That doesn't seem right when I say it though. Uh, yo, Red Band, I a dog, tell this Hans guy to tighten the fuck up and get working on his comedy and do not ever disrespect Tony like that, insulting him. I put him in his place. Oh, right. What are you talking about? I have no idea what you're talking about. W when did Hans disrespect Tony? What are you talking about? Uh... Redman, would you ever collab or feature anyone from Rooster Teeth for a podcast episode? They're Austin-based, I believe. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. They are Austin-based, aren't they? I love Rooster Teeth. Of course, I would love to. I don't know. Uh, 
what are they doing nowadays though? I, I actually, you know, I was a big fan back in the day with, uh, what was it called? Red versus blue. But I, I don't really follow them that much anymore. Um, loved your reviews of the old school games and vintage. I grew up on those. Have you ever, have you seen the new YouTube A and E channel about vintage memorabilia? No, I haven't. The, the new YouTube A and E channel? I'll check it out. Is that what it's called? YouTube A and E? Huh, that's awesome. I love vintage memorabilia. I love vintage crap, like old school shit. You know, when we were looking at those old old games and stuff yesterday, just like shit like this. I mean, these old Nintendo boxes. Remember these boxes that they came in? How cool was that going to the store and getting like a cardboard box and instructions? Sometimes it came with posters. Oh man, I, 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 miss, I miss the good old days, man. And a lot of people gave me shit the other day because I posted uh, I posted some uh, a photo of some video games I bought recently, and people were like, "Oh, you you don't buy digital games? Why would you buy physical copies of the games?" And I tell you, man, I went through a phase maybe for like a year where I was a hundred percent digital, and then I remember playing the or or, or uh, I didn't have internet for like a week. My internet was down. I was trying to play a game. And if it was just a physical copy of the game, I could have played it. But since it was digital, it didn't work. And I thought about it. I was like, yeah, what What if like, or there's Grand Theft Auto shit? You know, if you have Grand Theft Auto, you can't buy regular Grand Theft Auto 3 anymore. They pulled it from the store. So if I had a physical copy of Grand Theft Auto 3, I will always be able to play that copy of Grand Theft Auto 3, right? For the most part. I mean, some games do rely on internet and shit a lot still. But uh, I'm down for physical copies just because I'd rather, you know, what if something happens, you get a copy of the game and they pull it or they just make it unavailable, you know? I mean, like, it would be nice just to be able to play it in the future. You know, I, I don't really 100% trust digital purchases of games it, and I mean and still even if you have the game uh, a physical copy of it you, when you plug it in you could still download it like this you know all the newest updates and stuff it's I don't know I, I, I'm, I'm still a physical game guy I mean it's the same price I mean if it was like half the price then it would probably be more digital game guy but like I'd rather have a, you know why not have extra stuff like it comes with stuff like, it's like for free, you get, oh, you get a box and instructions and other things. Like, you get to hold something. I don't know. Uh, do you think Joe's Club will be open by South by Southwest in March? Uh, I would think so, yeah. Uh, the, the box was part of the gift wrapping back then. Yeah, exactly. The best Xmas gifts were those Nintendo games. I tell you, aren't right, Greg? Oh, hey, Greg, did you get the replacement mug? Uh, we sent you out a replacement mug because uh, I guess your you, your uh, mailbox postman is that what it's called? Your postman likes to drop kick all your packages. I guess. I saw a clip of Frank Caliendo doing a good Joe Rogan impression. Oh, really? Wow. Let me see if I can find that. We were talking about that last night or a couple nights ago. How. You know, they had Pete Davidson do a Joe Rogan impression, uh, and it was just so poor. Like, he didn't have any, uh, uh, he didn't do anything with his voice or anything. It just was a lazy Joe Rogan impression. I would love to see somebody doing a real good Joe Rogan impression. Uh, wow. Do you know where you saw it? It's not coming up. Um, it's not coming up. Hmm. Oh shit, Simon, thank you for the tip. 777, thank you buddy. Cheers. Uh, I miss buying physical PC games. Remember picking up the HL2 on disc? Yeah, hell yeah, Half-Life 2, baby. Everyone ripped it up. Uh, Yeah, anyone have an extra garage door they don't need? What? Lucky. It's a small clip. It was hard to find. It was on a YouTube short. Huh. Let's see if I can... I'll, I'll look one more time. Because I, I really want to see a, 
a good Joe Rogan impression. Uh, Tim Dillon has a funny Joe Rogan impression. Uh, there was there is a guy named Brett Pe Brent Pella that constantly does Joe Rogan impressions, but I don't think he's good either. Um, Bush impression. No, it's not coming up. Well, if you ever find it, send me a link. I would like to see it. Uh, Kyle Dunningham does a hilarious... Kyle Dunningham does a lot of funny impressions. I love... By the way, if you guys don't know who... Uh, don't know who Jeff's... Jeff... Uh, oh, my God. I'm drawing a blank. Jeff Richards is. He's been on a few episodes of Dead Air before, but Jeff Re Richards does an amazing... Uh, Amazing impressions. Oh, that reminds me. While while we're here, I'm going to text Brian Holtzman to see if he's in town. Maybe we have the return of Brian Holtzman. Thursday, secret show. I just realized this might be a Brian Holtzman week. Uh, okay. Uh, download Zombies Ate My Neighbors on Xbox for a playthrough. Okay. Bro, talking about the show that just fucking aired. All right, calm down, Build-A-Bear. You're intense. On Kill Tony, Hans said, quote, there's no girls at Tony. And Tony much said, what the fuck? There's no girls at Tony's. All right, dude, you need to chill out. I have no idea what you're talking about. Uh, it had an Adam Sandler impression on the label. Hmm. Oh, well, if you find it, let me know. Uh, yes, I got the unbroken one drinking out of it now. Cheers. Eight days a week straight and tomorrow off. Hell yeah, buddy. Congratulations, Greg, and cheers to you. Ari Manis in the house. Oh, hey, Ari Manis. Shit, there was something I was going to ask you that I can't remember. Check out Ari's uh, amazing podcast, uh, Unlicensed Therapy. Uh, I, I was on it. Ari's a great guy. He needs to come to Austin, hang out. Uh... Theo Vaughn was in town a couple of weeks ago, did my, did my show. I was really hoping Ari was with him, but he wasn't. I was really bummed out. Uh, you swear you have deja vu right now. Don't you hate that? Atem. What camera setup are you using right now? Oh, hey, Ari. Uh, sorry, I didn't read that part. Uh, overkill, Ari. Ari, this is... Uh, one of the most overkill cameras everywhere, anywhere. You can actually tell when you zoom in on my gross ass fucking, look at that beard, I need to shave this shit. Uh, I'm using the Sony A7S III. Uh, I was, I bought it and uh, you know, I wasn't gonna use it for streaming. I was gonna use it for video and stuff. And then when I started doing this shit, I just didn't like how the webcam looked and I was like, I could just use my fucking overkill camera for this, and I love it. It looks great, but it's such overkill. It's totally retarded. Uh, but yeah, it's Sony A7S uh, III connected to uh, a Elgato capture card. Um, super overkill. God, I need a look at. I just look like a mess. I like having a beard, but when you when you have a gray hair in your beard, it just makes it look fucking gross. I need to just for men my beard, I think. By the way, this is getting too hot. Um, let's see, where am I? The episode that just aired yesterday and the first time that Hans did not have and nobody to kiss. Tell him that he can kiss my asshole. Literally, I'll let him dead up. Okay. Build a bear. It's not the first time that Hans didn't kiss anybody. And you need to calm down. I think you misheard something or you're really unstable. 
Holtzman needs his own place. He can't be living with some random family. I mean, I agree. He has his own place. He still has a ha- uh, his own place in Los Angeles. He just goes back and forth uh, and stuff. But... Playing Battlefront on PS4 and Red Band comes on killing me, dude. Future Nobody, I heard Battlefront sucks. I, everyone told me to, to... Wait, Battlefront. Is that the same as Battlefield? No, I'm thinking of Battlefield. I heard that new Battlefield is a mess also. Like, I heard somebody told me to play it. Like, you can play, like... What is it? 10 hours for free or something like that? I don't even know what it was. Uh, but... Right when I was about to play it, I watched a review on it, and everyone says that that's, it's just a mess. Also, all these game companies just need to calm down and stop releasing these messes. Uh, that Theo show looked dope. Yeah, Ari, it was awesome. Theo was on a secret show two weeks ago. Yeah. Do you own Tesla stock, Red Band? No, uh, I was going to, uh, I was going to, my setup looks great. This is a, this room's a mess. By the way, this week, uh, I'm going to redo this room uh, tomorrow. So uh, this room will start looking a little bit better. I haven't even hung up my Brody thing that my friend sent me. and It's crazy. Uh, yeah. Do you see the trailer Halo TV series? No, I haven't. Do I own Tesla stock? No, I don't. I was going to wait for Tesla to split their stock again and maybe buy some. I, I don't really fuck with stock much. I have AMC. I got uh, Dogecoin. I got some Dogecoin left. I sold a lot of it, but uh, I have AMC and Doge. What's your email? I found it. Uh, virt- uh, virtual Red Band at Gmail. All one word, virtual red band at gmail. Looking like Tom Segura, I know, right? Uh, any plan to dye the facial hair orange? Fuck that. Red band, I'm in between jobs. What should I do for a living? Uh, if you're in between jobs, you know, food delivery. I wouldn't want an Uber or Lyft, but I think food delivery jobs seem pretty legit. You just drop people's food off, you know. I mean, unless until you do something. I don't know what you're good at, so I'm not going to tell you what to do but yeah I mean this camera is pretty pretty great uh he told me his heart is in LA that's called his girlfriend uh what is the artwork behind you uh that's some Akira paintings that I need to hang up it's actually three paintings that all go together that make one painting. So I need to hang that up and I got the Brody painting and then this painting in the back is a painting I did a long time ago. And there's another Brody. I, I, you know what? I've been realizing that I have too much Brody things around my house. Like it's kind of a little bit uncomfortable because I'm, I just got too much Brody stuff around my house. I love Brody, but I mean, even him, he, he would be like, yes, my biggest fan, you know, like, uh, all right, let's smoke some green tea and read the rest of these comments before we start. It's already 26 minutes in. Austin is a younger scene. I could see it being a bit different for Holtz. Uh, Brad, you're actually wrong. What's crazy is not only does the audience love Holtzman, but the comics, the, the, the comedy community ha- has embraced Holtzman Bigger than I've ever seen anybody get embraced uh, to the point where literally he's on more shows than most comics in Austin. Like he's on like three a night sometimes. I mean, he's just on the young comics out here. Love him. Uh, yeah. So true. I wish the game companies would test their shit before release. I mean, I they, 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 they use us as testers nowadays, it seems like. And I don't know, man. It's maybe they need to start releasing games early or, or regular but let like call them betas you know like hey the, the final release is december 25th but you can play it now if you want to just so you know though you're helping us beta test this uh but the the final release will be december 25th you know something like that 
I mean, that's kind of what they do already. <coughs> oh my God. New Battlefield Blows, Hollow Multiplayer Killing It. Battlefront is Star Wars. Ah, Battlefront. Yeah, I used to play Battlefront back in the day. That's what I thought. Um, yep. Have you seen Rogan's Self Suck? No, but isn't that funny? I think I've actually talked about that on the JRE before about how I can suck my dick also. Not suck it. I can kiss it with my tongue. Just the tip of my dick, I can put my tongue on it. I think I've talked about that on Rogan's podcast before, and I think him, I remember him going bullshit or ew or something like I forget what he did, but it's kind of weird that he he's saying that now because it's like I, I I used to say that I even have a bit about it, uh, but there we go. People asking why aren't you opening up for Rogan? There you go. That's me and Joe both have the same things we talk about. Uh, how long does the Death Squad gear take to ship out? Five to seven days. Honestly, Janice has been doing it every couple days now. So whenever you put an order in, I would probably say three to four days, it will ship. And then shipping is one to three days, depending where you live. Unless you live out of the country, then I have no idea how long it takes. Do you know who is an excellent comic and really nice and always respectful? Hans Kim. I agree. That's why I don't understand what that other Build-A-Bear dude was talking about. Hey, Reban, did you get to... Did you get to you... By the way, Build-A-Bear, you need to spend less time fucking chat... Are you foreign or something? You, you're, you do not how to know how to make sentences. You almost like seem like a bot. Hey, Red Band, did you get to you that episode 500 girl? You did you try upside down question mark and taste like honey nut Cheerios, Katie? I mean, that really is not a sentence, Build a Bear. Uh, Holtzman murders on stage and in life. Yep. I got to check out the new Ford Bronco. Pretty dope, but it wouldn't trust the stop. Yeah, I wanted to get a new. The Ford Bronco was actually, I was going to uh, sell my Civic and buy a Bronco. But also with the Bronco, a lot of issues I've noticed. Uh, a lot of people having problems with certain things on it. I think with any car that comes out, you got to wait two to three years, you know, like I wouldn't like I want the Cybertruck, but I'm not going to I'm not going to get the first edition. I'll get I'll get Cybertruck four years after its first release. You know, too many too many bugs. Uh, yeah. That black dude from last week needs to be a new regular. I like that guy. He was really cool. I had him on the secret show. He was really nervous on the secret show, though. Uh, the only thing is, he, I, I, I think he's an actor also. So I really wonder if he wants to be a stand-up comedian or an actor. But I, I like him. I thought he was great. Uh, I wonder how... He, you know he reminds me of? He reminds me of... Uh, um, Preacher Lawson, who is a friend of mine, uh, who blew up. He was on Kill Tony, too. Lucas is headlining now. He's literally too big, literally and metaphorically, for the show. Uh, all right, here we go. Another brilliant sentence from Build-A-Bear. Scruffyman81, no strongly disagree. Kill Tony, a.k.a. The shits gave birth to Hans Kim. Tony is the best Thai he that his life is chosen by Jesus. Jesus. Taking a test right now, Red Bum. Going back to work Thursday for secret show. Nice. Where are you taking a test right now? It's 11.20. Oh God, another one. Hans Kim. Am tired of talking about how you look Chinese. Well, he's, he's Korean, dude. You know what? 
you need to really chill out. Uh, Tesla will go 3,000 per share by 2025. Don't underestimate Tesla insurance, Tesla bought Tesla. And, oh, I, I agree, JRC, I'm 100%. Uh, it's just, I'm just kind of upset with myself for not getting on Tesla's stock earlier. Like I was hoping he would split again. Uh, I guess I, I should invest, but I just, you know, I really don't, I really don't want to, I mean, that's, that's like gambling to me. I, I'm, I don't like gambling, you know, when it comes to like buying AMC stock or Dogecoin, when it's like, you know, not, it doesn't really feel like gambling. It's almost feels like, Hey, I hear some cash, you know, but when you're like spending that kind of money on a stock, that, that, that to me is scary. I don't want to like sp spend like life st savings type shit. And then like, Esla rapes a uh, rapes somebody or something. I don't. You know what I mean? Did I call him Esla? <laughs> Elon. Um, I live three hours from here. I should get my thrust shirt quick then. Yeah, it should be only one day shipping. But who knows? One thing I've noticed about Texas is the post office sucks here, or at least where I live, just a horrible post office. Like, there's a, I just have a lot of issues. With I, I've always had issues with post offices. The, I mean, the postal service in general. There's just they're just kind of a, a mess. But this the one out by me is just ridiculous. They actually I think hire like Uber drivers to pick up people's mail and stuff because people pick up my mail at my house like packages and stuff and they they look like straight up Uber drivers. Like they 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 definitely are third party they're not in like male uniforms they're just like hood i mean I, I constantly think people are stealing packages off my porch but it's just like third party how long have you used the intro music for kill tony episodes how long uh no idea. I, there's been a few versions. <clears throat> Where is Holtzman? When are you going to make another one with him or just help? Holtzman said, told me he was going to be back the 14th. It is now the 16th. So hopefully he is back. Um, all right, I'm going to get through these comments and then get into the video game or into VR. Uh, I'm gonna go through quick. Um, bah, 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 bah. I didn't know you could do an upside down question mark. Yeah, there's a lot of things you can do. I have, how come you don't talk much on Kill Tony? Honestly, uh, because Tony loves talking. And uh, no, and I'm also constantly like looking for sound effects or thinking of, you know, music to play and stuff. You'll notice like the next three episodes, uh, it really started in. Uh, skank fest we didn't have a band and uh, so I relied on how it like old school where I used my iPad a lot more where I was searching for songs a lot more and doing intros and outros when people get on stage and stuff uh, I uh, the last three episodes or so I went back to that formula a little and that I mean that's pretty much what I'm doing I'm constantly like I'm not, doing a lot of stuff that you guys don't see. Like, you know, I'm telling the band like, hey, calm down, or hey, Hans Kim is next, play Hans song, or, you know, you know, doing that thing with the band while on the iPad uh, doing like, trying to find sounds and stuff and get things ready just in case of certain things happen. I mean, I look at somebody when they go on stage and go, all right, this guy seems like he's a redneck. So I think of redneck songs, you know, and, or, and I look up stuff and, uh, when, if I was just sitting there with none of that responsibility, uh, I would definitely be talking more, but you know, Tony talks a lot. I don't know if you've noticed, uh, I look at when we have a guest on the show, the guest probably talks a total of two minutes and Tony talks at the, about an hour and a half. It's kind of, <laughs> 
Um, where am I? Oh, you're testing at home, dog. I'm negative. Uh, if it's one of those disposable tests, just I'd be I'd probably get a second test. Try a second test. Uh, those tests are garbage, just so you know. Uh, but I mean, it's been a long enough time. What it's been like a week? That's about right. Uh, free Chinese takeout. I have a theory that comedians like to gamble because stand up is a type of gambling. Um, I don't really know many comedians that gamble, honestly. Uh, most comedians I know are poor. Uh, Brian, don't kick yourself in the ass by not getting into sheep coin while it's dirt cheap. Oh, I know. I was looking up sheep coin. I'm waiting for... Uh, I, I, I just need to buy it. Uh, I was waiting for... There was rumors that Robin Hood was going to uh, start... Start selling it. And... Uh, I know, I'm one of those idiots that uses Robinhood. It's just easier on me. But I, I, I guess I can go through Coinbase or whatever. But yeah, I, I feel like I'm going to... I need to do that. I agree. Thanks for reminding me. I was going to buy, buy it like two weeks ago. Um, God, all right. Let's finish these up real quick. Buying stock in Tesla is not gambling. The company has sold fundamentals of. Buying stock in Tesla is not gambling. The company has solid fundamentals. I agree. They have multiple profitable quarters. Of course, profit at 30%. Just trying to help you. Oh, no, I agree. I, JRC, I agree. I agree. It's just, you know, I'm just not a gambler. I think maybe what I've just talked about explained it more. I just hate gambling. Never been a gambler. Don't like gambling. And I, I, stock market's kind of like gambling to me. I'd rather keep it and buy Nintendo games, you know? Like, I don't know. It's just, I don't have that gambler bone in my body. It's like the one, the, the most Jewish thing about me, I guess. Uh, that was fun. I enjoyed the iPad music, old school vibes. I've noticed all that stuff, by the way. You know, bro, kill Tony. Oh, God. It's like who, I didn't even look at who was talking. I just started reading the person and then... Uh, Jesus Christ. Build-A-Bear, are you foreign or not? Or are you just retarded? Uh, Red Band, do you know how to play any musical instruments? I used to, I, I used to play the trumpet, the bassoon, uh, briefly the tuba, uh, but, and, and I also played keyboard, but I don't remember any of it. I have a trumpet, I bought a trumpet, recently I bought a trumpet and I don't remember any of it. It went away. It was one of those things that went away, you know, like uh, my brain pushed it out of my head and it's like, hey, we need to make room for how to use computers or something like that. He hasn't been using this trumpet info in a while, so let's push, push that out, you know. Uh, Doug Stanhope said that he was going to steal the idea for Kill Tony and said you can sue him. Uh, I still want a legit spinoff of the show for VR. Uh, okay, I got to go through this real quick, guys. Where am I? Oh, my God. Am I, was I that far behind? No, 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 no. Right, what the fuck, Red Band? Tony looks rich. He just look, doesn't... Dude, Tony looks rich. He just looks wealthy. Oh my God, you, you're, you can't even spell to make a point. I'm guessing you're saying, what the fuck, Red Band? Dude, Tony doesn't look rich. He just looks wealthy. I mean, you can't even talk, man. You know what? All right, you know what? I'm done with you. You just annoy me. Fucking doesn't know how to talk or answer questions. Uh, Miss Pat, Michael Rapp, Raspaport, and Joe Roger as a guest. I fucked up, bro. Well, okay. Jihad, more. All right. All right. All right. All right. Cool. Play. What VR application do you wish? Do you wish ex existed? 
Um, you know what? Uh, like a, uh, how would I explain it? I wish there was a app that was like, what's that fucking annoying thing that I think they just added it to Twitter where it's just somebody talking, uh, What's that thing where it's just like you're, you're, you're joining a chat room pretty much with people talking. Fuck, what's it called? Clubhouse. You guys know Clubhouse and how like Twitter kind of added the same kind of thing in there. I wish there was like a Clubhouse, but it was video like Zoom calls, uh, but in VR. So you can like join chat rooms with just random people on subjects, but it's video. Now you have VR, so you're like, how are you, how are you supposed to do that? Uh, which I agree, but maybe it's like it's super ultra realistic avatars of yourself. Like you have to take your iPhone and like put it on a tripod and take have it take like photos of you just doing this until it gets like a complete hyper realistic scan of your face, you know? And it's just like a chat room in VR or something. I think that would be fun. I don't really, you know, things like that. Uh, no trombone. No, I never played trombone. Um, um, there, was a, there was a question I wanted to answer. Where is it? Oh, shit. Did I lose it? I just remember I, I read some question. I was like, oh, that's a good question. Um, where was it? Oh, I found, lost it. Mm. Is it hard being completely annoyed with 99% of fans, i.e. Build-A-Bear? Uh, no, I mean, everyone, I, th I think there's a good difference between somebody that means well or whatever and somebody that's straight up trolling. Uh, yeah, sure, trolling is dumb and annoying, but, you know, I've been around it f for 20 years. Uh, where some people that are just dumb and stuff, where at least I feel like they're dumb because they're trolling, it's just dumb. Uh, but some people are just like, I feel bad for them. You know, like, oh, you know, that's just some poor little idiot. <laughs> I don't know. I think that was a bad answer. Um, we're part of Columbus, Worthington, and Dublin. Uh, I also lived in Grandview a little. Um, playing with live audio animation of 3D models. Yes. That will work to scan when you open your mouth. But will not work when you open your mouth in VR. That would work to scan, but not... Uh, I mean, what if you had, like, scans of you going, ah, you know, like that. You had to go, ah, 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 ah. Um, wow, my viewers are higher than usual. No, they're not. It's pretty low. Uh, let's see. Yeah, it's pretty low. Um, by the way, guys, we are streaming on Twitch, Twitter, and YouTube, but... Uh, pretty soon, we're going to just be streaming on YouTube. So if you want to watch the rest of this or in the future, always go to youtube.com slash redband. And please hit subscribe and hit the bell button so that you can be notified when we do these. A lot of times, these are deleted. I mean, lately, we haven't been really deleting much. Uh, like, I thought I was going to delete yesterday's episode, but it ended up being really good, I thought. So I was like, you know what, I'm going to just keep it up. Just sometimes, you know, it gets a little annoying. The Space Hay app doesn't come up in iTunes apps, only on desktop. The Space Hay, Space Hay is actually just a website right now. I don't think it's actually an app. You, know, I'm, you just got to go to spacehay.com. We talked about that yesterday, by the way. If you were a fan of MySpace, there's this website called Space Hay. And it was either yesterday or the day before I told everyone, you got to get your Space Hay address you know like you have to claim your screen name now because it seems like this might blow up 
Uh, this is pretty much a website that just looks like classic MySpace and you could do classic profiles. Remember the annoying profiles? Like just designer garbage, like people who, like people like me who went to like art, you know, I don't know, just for design reasons, it was mostly garbage. But once it was gone, I missed it. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, so anyways, go to Space Hay and get your, uh, Get your uh, website address, spacehay.com. Space Hay is not a weed site. Um, okay, guys, this is your five-minute warning. In five minutes, we'll be in virtual reality. I'm going to pretty much get some more ice for my drink, uh, maybe take a piss real quick, and in five minutes, I'll be back. Uh, but in five minutes, I won't be back here. I'll be in virtual reality. That's right. We are in virtual reality, and this is that new... Look at this new camper. Look, some chick is driving me. We are on a road trip in a camper. Really makes me want to get a camper. I tell you why. I mean, the more I think about it, the more I like the idea. Um, anyways, this is your five minute warning. In five minutes, we'll be back in virtual reality. So go grab a drink, go take a piss, go walk the dog. Go get something to eat. Go switch TVs. Switch off your phone. Go in your bedroom. Turn on the Apple TV. Get on the YouTube app. Join this. And then just sit around and look at fucking TikToks. This is a good background noise show. It's just me playing video games, guys. This isn't a podcast. This is just literally me playing video games and talking. And you never know what's going to happen. We play a lot of little dumb games on here. There's a group of us that all sit around and talk. Sometimes we go to open mics and do some comedy and music. Anyways, this is your five minute warning. In five minutes, we'll be back in virtual reality. Bye. Oh, and by the way, Britney Spears, man, like really, she is a crackhead, right? What the fuck? I mean, I know Save Britney and shit was cool, but what the actual hell? You guys follow her on Instagram? What the fuck? Why does she look like a meth head? She just looks like a meth head on the like the TV show Cops. Is she a meth head? Is there any data of her being a meth head? I mean, she kind of looks like a like a meth head. All right, I didn't say that. I'm just kidding. Ha ha ha! Don't cancel me. All right, love you. All right.
24 hours. Let your conscience be your guide. Praise be to Allah. If you having girl problems, I feel bad for you, son. I got 99 problems, but a bitch ain't one. I got Your time has expired. You had your opportunity, but you did not take it. No more will you fuck my unwashed cave-dwelling asshole. No more will the world believe your hideous lies about high-speed access and your blasphemous deceit about knowledgeable customer service staff. No more will I sit on hold waiting for you to answer the fucking phone and start my fucking DSL. May Allah have pity on your souls. This infidel will now be built beaten ruthlessly with an aluminum cookie pan and it will rest on your conscience like a fat dog sleeping on the sofa he's not allowed to be on and such. Allah Akbar! Glad we ordered these swivel bucket seats. <laughs> yeah, in case I get to drive someday. The Cutlass S, Oldsmobile's sporty fastback at a price that's less than you might think to help make you really drive happy. Drive happy. Can I drive now? I went to the Olive Garden last night and had the best meal because I went to the Olive Garden and guess what? I'm not sitting there disappointed. I'm like, no, this salad is awesome. These breadsticks are awesome. This is awesome. This is awesome. This is awesome. This is awesome. All you can eat pasta and everything cost me $40. I'm just a normal person that's like, wait, I spent $12 on free breadsticks and all you can eat salad and all you can eat pasta for $12? Really? I did. I, I just did that and you just spent like seven dollars at wendy's well, it's like they're perfected this. this shit go to the olive garden when you're here your family hey hey, hey. hey. You're supposed to wait two weeks, you know that, when you have COVID.
fucking monitor is freaking the fuck out. Yeah. Oh well, this is annoying. Uh, yeah. So Janice is addicted to Grand Theft Auto now. Uh, yeah, she's she's playing Vice. Okay. Switch on so they can hear you. <clears throat> yeah, she, I got the collect whatever the <coughs> shitty thing I was talking about last night. Yeah. Because she's, she's like, I just want to play it and see how bad it is and stuff. And I was like, wait, you've never played Grand Theft Auto before? And she's like, no. And I'm like, oh, well, fine, yeah. Uh, first one, Vice, Vice or, no, or the first one, uh, Grand Theft Auto 3, that was a hot mess. I mean, it was almost unplayable. Like there was parts where I couldn't see anything because it was so dark and then it started raining and it was like uh, even worse. It was like trying to go through like uh, a snowstorm and trying to drive. It was horrible. But uh, yeah, Vice City looks bad. Pretty good though. You got any Thanksgiving plans? That's the only one I played. Yeah. Red, you know. uh, me and oh, Janice okay. usually. Brian, you got. Me and Janice usually uh, uh, go to a, like a nice restaurant because it's so much easier just like going to a restaurant so and then easier. having like <laughs> your favorite restaurant cook like a Thanksgiving. What, what's their version of Thanksgiving? Like I this year, I think we're going to go to Fogo de Chao just because I, I we love Fogo. And we love like nice. meat and shit. Brazilian and, steakhouse. Yeah, <laughs> they're they're having like a Thanksgiving thing. So love to see their version of Thanksgiving, you know. And I mean, we used to always like get together with friends and stuff like that. But it's like really, if you're a fan of eating out or going to restaurants, it really is one of those nights that it's like, dude. Imagine your favorite restaurant, but now like they're doing their version of Thanksgiving. Like they don't have that on the menu. They're actually going to make it better than normal. Their normal food, probably. You know. Yeah, yeah. I find that too. Yeah. Every anytime I do Thanksgiving, I'm like a badass restaurant. It's mm -hmm. like it's the shit. They're yeah. like cooking up the turkey. Yeah. And plus, potatoes, it's way easier. Yeah. Like you know, fucking all that Thanksgiving cooking. I, that's just like a lot of work. And then you just have so much leftovers. Like what? I don't want Thanksgiving four days, but I have to, you know? <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's a big part of it that folks don't take into account is how sick of Turkey you are after yeah. day two. Yeah. I'm not even a fan of Turkey. Like I, I fuck Turkey. I do miss Ham the, is the superior meat. Yeah. Yeah, I like ham better, and I, I honestly I don't even care. Like, like if it's just like a nice steak or something, I don't give a fuck. That's why Fogo is gonna be cool because I think they're gonna have like the turkey shit, but they're also gonna have all the steaks they usually have, like oh, hell yeah. the, the pinkenia or pequenia or whatever the fuck it's called, pecanie. Nice, Matthew pecanie. Yeah, uh, <laughs> 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 it's gonna be a lean meat, <laughs> the Matthew McConaughey. <laughs> all right. <laughs> Oh, where's K at? I'm surprised <laughs> K is not here. Uh, all right, all right, all right. Yeah, I, I, uh, today we had Crave yonder. You got to check out that Crave. It's in Pflugerville, though, but it used to be like a really popular food truck. And they have locations in Los Angeles and everything. But what's cool is, is that it's like all the items... Uh, like there's some like where I live, there's every fast food, there's every like there's In and Out, Water Burger, Jack in the Box, Sonic, Wendy's, McDonald's, Burger King, like Popeyes, KFC, like every single like Chick Fil A, they have every single you know fast food restaurant near my house, like like all together. But it's like sometimes you're just like you know what, like I'm so sick of chicken, I'm so sick of burgers, I'm so sick of everything. You go there and it has like all the odds and ends, like all the things that you're like, oh, now there we go, like bratwurst and and corn nuggets and like pulled pork and chicken sandwiches, like little sliders, like 
and they have like seven different kinds of barbecue sauce at the table like in squeeze bottles like they have like all the different cities that are popular like oh you know st louis style or you know east coast style west coast style. Memphis sweet like they have sweet ones mm -hmm. saint you know and and like so it's what, cool what, what you part of yeah. is it in? it's right right next to uh, uh the gym across the street from your house uh uh what's it called uh, you know the big gym uh was it world's gym or whatever the big one is that's right next to bush's chicken it's right next to bush's chicken bush, oh yeah 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 okay oh yeah dude yeah, i yeah. was just craving okay. hot dogs the other day like almost got stuff to make hot dogs with and then i saw that and i was like fuck dude where is this I this know, is what i good, want right <laughs> well and, and the cool thing is yeah. every tuesday it's two dollar hot dogs so you can just get like chili oh, dogs you. you can get whatever it is whatever Ooh. kind of hot dog it's two bucks super good deal yeah. and nice. i recommend the corn well nuggets. i go to pflugerville <laughs> to get gas anyway from costco so oh you do that's that's, that's my thing that's my that's costco already, yeah yeah, that yeah. Costco's the shit, man. That's pretty much where me and Mark live, yeah. right there. I didn't yeah. go in the other day for obvious reasons. I just got gas. Right. But, uh, yeah. But, yeah. I can't even take advantage of that. It's so cheap anyways in Texas. Like, it's ridiculous. Like, Los Angeles right now is double. Uh, oh, my God. Yeah, it's like 5 to $6. Crazy. Yeah, but Costco like still gives you that extra, what, extra dime. Right. A gallon, pretty much. Yeah, yeah. And plus, I'm driving that truck. Jesus Christ! Oh my God! Oh my God. Your microphone's all static. Oh my God! Yeah, that was that was annoying. It was like a it was like a TV. In. Yeah, TV static. We're trying to get off the porn. This, this episode of Virtual Revenue brought to you by David Lynch. Right? Jeez, I haven't heard static like that in a long time. That was straight up TV static. <laughs> TV <Diane>. static. Diane. <laughs> uh, yeah, the only thing I don't like about where I live, while there's tons of fast food there's not many rest like mom and pop restaurants that's the the one thing i yeah. wish it had more of like we literally have every single chain restaurant and in chain fast food but barely any mom and pops like i always have to go like outside like drive like 15 20 minutes away just to go to like a legit restaurant which isn't bad it's 15 20 minutes sorry about that yes that was exactly hey. tv static I see it. That'd what? be radio fucking um, link on. You know that little drone link I sent you? I yeah. plugged that in. Mm. Yeah, and it's fucking automatically switched my audio card to that. Mm. So sorry about that. How are we rolling? What's that? How's it going, Kate? Fuck yeah. Tired. I still really oh, yeah. love this RV, by the way. This is a fucking awesome. Yeah, I said it to my home world. It's comforting. Yeah. It's fucking cool. Yeah. Yeah, I put it in my home world as well. Dude. Yep, it's my home world. Brian, you got to get a fucking RV, dude. <laughs> I, I'm you know, leaning you know, towards you know. it, but also, I bought an elliptical the other day. That's fine. I'll, I'll oh shit! Sure. That counts. <laughs> it's got a big screen. It does. Big screen on yeah, it. Yeah, it's got a big screen there on it. There you go. And yeah. Oh, that's, yeah. That's that's cool. I may try to play <laughs> VR while being on it and see if I could do that. That might be wow. That might be yep. scary. He's out of breath all the time. <laughs> hey guys, guys, let's feed the dogs. <laughs> <laughs> that's 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 still my home world after all the these dogs. after all these years. Have it's they still updated? my world. They, they really day. need to update that. No, they make every it bigger. day I can't go to any other world until I feed the baby ducks. I don't care about the other ducks. They give them for themselves, but I feed the baby ducks. And then I can leave. I have to do that every time. I saw my OCD about it. Wow. Psycho. I know. It's, <laughs> hey, but I'll, I'll admit it freely. So that has to count for something. Yeah, yeah. Psycho a killer. Bit. A little bit. <laughs> so you know those, uh, uh, you know that blurred money I have? Like the, where yo, it's like yeah. a stack of money, but it's blurry. So that's from a company called Mischief, and this guy I know who works for Good Mythical Morning, Chef Josh, uh, he com he teamed up with them and made illegal potato chips. And there are three things 
three flavors that are illegal to eat. So you know how like you usually have like sour cream potato chips or salted or vinegar. Well, one of them's horse meat, uh, and it's tastes, <laughs> tastes just like if you were eating horse meat potato chips. The uh, the other one is a puffer fish, like the, that puffer fish that's like super illegal in the United States because it can kill you if it's not dissected yeah. proper. Yeah, so. Uh, yeah, he, it's just the there's poison glands. Right. So he poison got like teamed up with some sad. scientists to get the exact taste of it and it even like makes your mouth kind of tingle when you eat it because it's like your mouth yep. thinks it's getting poisoned and shit. And the third one is uh that maggot cheese. Like the cheese that that maggots Whoa, like... whoa, this came up in a conversation the other day. What the oh, fuck? Right. I didn't realize this was a thing. Yeah. Maggot cheese. It's cheese where you know, maggot... maggots live on and they go through and they eat it and shit it back out. And and it's... Uh... Yeah. Well, that's what a cheese mite does. Like, right. you actually need cheese mites to make cheese. Right. Well, that's illegal in the United States also, thank God. But he also made that... That's why that... your cheese is orange. That's why he made the cheese, though. He... So it's... And you can get... You can buy a three-pack of all three of these chips. I think it's on... A... It's not a sponsor, but uh, it's called IllegalSnacks.com, I think. But it's just look up <laughs> illegal potato chips mischief M S C H F. Uh, I think you could still buy them, but I just think it, yeah, it's gross. But it's one of those things that's gross. But I still want to kind of try it, you know. You know, a maggot can survive the stomach acid of a human. Really? Like if you eat it, it can survive the stomach acid. <laughs> wow, that's fucking. So make crazy. sure you chew your maggots. Fucking you know this is this is so informative because I've been watching this show called <clears throat> Joe Para talks to you. It's a it's an Adult Swim show. Joe Para is is this comic, and it's the most wholesome. They're ten minute episodes, and it's literally the most wholesome content ever. He's like an old man, but he's young, and he talks just says random things about random stuff that you would never think about. Right. And it's all I've been watching all day, and this kind of reminds me of it. Yeah. I'm gonna a, hold on. I'm, I'm gonna sound crazy. I'm gonna post this somewhere. I'm gonna take the dog out. Yeah. So the cheese is called Casu Marzu. It's maggot cheese. It's also horse meat, and the website is illegalchips.com. Uh, the horse meat one's you. interesting. Yeah, I want to know what that's like. Well, mortadella in the traditional sense. Um, like the traditional Italian recipe for mortadella in includes horse. Wow. Tried horse wasn't mm. the fan. Yeah. And I mean, there was that, I don't know if you remember that whole thing in the UK where there was, um, this, they basically came out that there was horse meat being sold as right. beef in supermarkets throughout yeah. the UK. Yeah. I do. So, I mean, if you don't notice it all that much. <laughs> it's just that, I mean, I think. I think I'm on a fine line with cow right now. Like the more you just see how adorable cows are and smart cows are or pigs, the more I'm just like I just don't They're want adorable, to man. think about it. I just don't want to think about it. But horses it's like yep. next that's next that's like pets. That's like dog to me. Mm, like I, that's, All right, that, horses can be cunts, man. Oh, I don't of know course. if you've ever wild met a horses. shit horse, but wild horses sure. Uh, but... even non-wild horses can be cunts. Like if they'll bite, they'll kick, they can be cunts. Yeah, I mean, I got... <laughs> the last time I rode a horse, I was about 10 years old, and I got bucked off a horse. And uh, I was squeezing my legs too hard around the horse, is what the, somebody told me. And so the horse As you tell me the off, story, and I could have died, or I could have been Christopher Reeved, but I have not been on As a horse you tell this story, I can only hear Tony's taglines. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, what's up, Eon? <clears throat> How's your mic? Controller. Your mic's and, quiet. And how does my mic sound? <laughs> it's quiet. A little quiet. Because I spent, I spent 50 bucks on a new one. Oh, it's good. It's just quiet. You just need to turn it up. All right. How's that? Sounds good. Any yeah. better? Yeah. Sweet. Sounds good. Really good. Where are we going? We're just hanging out here talking, but we can go somewhere. Uh, let me see. 
I just posted a couple videos in the in the Discord. You should watch it. It's it's great. Of what? Oh, let me look. That that thing that I was watching is is hilarious. It's Joe Par Joe uh, Para Para Para, something like that. Huh. It's funny. Comedy. You'll love it. Yeah, it's great. Um, I'm very green to you. I don't think we've been here before, so let's try this out. <laughs> uh, with people. Hey, Kay, watch out real quick. Sorry, mate. Sorry. Uh, too close to spawn. Is, on, uh, do I have to go back here? Yeah, the spoon's just over there. Okay. Let's get out of your way. Um, where the fuck did it go? Oh, here we go. All right, let's try this out with pe with people. I the day I, I just sat in this world and got super Portal. I was just chilling. Nice. Agnes. That was a fun noise. Oh, well, we've been here before. Where's the where's the sound settings? Here's settings. Here's settings right here. Somehow. Wait. What's that do? How do you do it? Oh, wow, it gives you a fucking desktop. Where? How do you use it? Oh, you have to hit this. No, shut it. Oh, it gave me a Walkman. Yeah, it gave me a Walkman. How do I... It says just put it close to your hip bone. Attach it. Is that... They can't work. Oh, this thing's fucking good. Yeah, I don't. I don't get it. Fuck that. Uh, attach to your hip for easy travel. Change various settings on the fly. Easy to use. No, it's not. Uh, gluten free. All right. What am I missing here? How is this easy to use? Is that a butt? No. Uh, so not easy to use. Change what are the they? Layout. What are they talking about? Easy to use. They changed the layout a little bit. Ooh, this is nice. Hola. All right, this music's garbage. <laughs> Thank you. 
Theater. Whoa. That's cool. Wow, epilepsy warning, everybody. Mirror. Cool. Hello, Lucy. Do you talk? No. This is cool. Do you understand how to use this setting station? I can't get anything to work. Oh, now it's working. It wasn't working before, huh? Oh, there we go. That's cool. Bye, Lucy. <laughs> oh, hey, the Walkman works out, oh, out hey. outside in the theater. Yeah, you can you can turn it on and click the shit on the screen. Yeah. Yeah, I I, I, I was doing it, it earlier, it just wasn't working. But out hey, do you guys know that you could dump up in here? Do what? You can do what? Double jump. Yeah. Heavy jump. Whoa. Fuck. <laughs> you know, this makes up for all of those worlds that don't let you jump at all. Right? I like this place. This place is good. If you guys ever played uh Boneworks, that like real realistic game in VR that you can like climb over shit and. Oh uh, no, uh, I know what you're talking about. That, I almost bought it. That, that but... shit made me. Al that shit almost yeah. made me puke. <laughs> yeah, I almost bought it, but I th I thought that I was gonna feel the same way. Yeah, it's it's rough. I only played it for a little bit. It's I mean it's it's super fun. Don't get me wrong, but goddamn, it's it's good watching the videos it's of it. Much. It's like, too much. If you go on Yahoo, way too much. <laughs> you, if you go on YouTube, you can actually watch people like. Play it through the whole thing. It's fun to watch that. I think I had more fun just watching that than playing it. Oh, I wish they had laser tag in here. Oh really? Yeah, this would be a cool, cool play. This would be really cool for a comedy club. Comedy club performance stage with never have I ever toggles and some other food based drinking games. Nice. Oh, well based. That's great. This would be cool. Yeah, I really like the design in here. Yeah, it's cool. Oh, they have the cool pool tables there too. 
Wait, can you play this shit? Bug fables. What is bug fables? That's the cute little uh, game. Is that a real game? Yeah, it's a real game. It looks adorable. All of these are real games. What is this? I love these 3D. These 3D posters are cool. Your microphone it's cuts fine. out a lot, by the way. Yeah, it's kind of broken. Oh. There's actually some playable games at the back. Wow, this the 3D effects that, that they use in this is really good. This is like look yeah. down look down in this. This is like 3D. That's crazy. But if you look to the side, you'll see it's not. They've just sort right, of right. projected it in there through a bit of glass or something. Right, that's, that's cool. really cool. Very cool effects. Smart. Is this real? Yeah. Now, these games over here play. Which ones? In the back. Oh, yeah. Doo doo fart. I like doo doo farts. I, I don't know how doo doo fart works, but flappy hat. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sense. I love these 3D poster cases. So cool. Oh man, this place is badass. Yeah. Oh, fuck, you How the did I was on here. SNL, right? <laughs> uh, was it last year or something like that? Hello, hi. Yeah. How's it going, Cat Bread? He rides his bike around New York City. What's up for that cube? Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, try to catch. Oh, that's lame. What happens if you turn it on? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> yeah, it's got it's some good gravity. Oh, and you may ask yourself, how do I work oh, this? Wait, why is it? Why is it? Whoa. <laughs> what, what, what the fuck happened? is that? <laughs> what is happening? Run away, cube, never coming back. Now, what is this thing? Oh, that's a Roomba. Is this? that a Roomba? Yeah, I think so. Check out the theater, man. Whoa, you can do like a it's a petster. Of the there it goes. Oh, the physics in this <laughs> are bonkers. <laughs> yeah, it's super bonkers. <laughs> yeah, they need to open up a comedy club up here. That's awesome. Yeah, the, the yeah, elevators is like uh, rooftop coming parkour. soon. Yeah, this place is badass. Cow parkour. They've got the elevator source music playing in the elevator. I don't know if anyone's yeah. ever heard of that. Yeah. Ob obscure shit. Right. <coughs> Check this out, man. Hmm. Oh yeah, I went out there already. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I already went out here. I already met Lucy. She doesn't talk. She just crawls on the ground. Whoa. 
but check out this is a video player the whole world to yeah player. yeah it's like that one world it's very nice I haven't been to a club in a long time. Maybe they look like this now. <laughs> <laughs> right? <laughs> real, uh, yeah. Back in our days, we house. had <laughs> tube TVs on the walls. Yeah. They had a, a film projector up on a ceiling. Yeah. And it fell from the ceiling and almost killed somebody on the dance floor. It was like crazy. So you got to secure shit when you got it up on the walls and stuff. The heavy duty things. Yeah. Uh oh, Lucy, why are you so sad? Is it are you sad because you don't have a microphone? Are you okay? We're supposed to ask you. Yeah. How are you, Lucy? Don't do it. Let's look at her hands. Make sure she doesn't do any hand movements. Like I think it's like if she puts her thumb no. in and then grips her hand. <laughs> that means yes. <laughs> no, that yeah, means grip your thumb for yes. yes. No, that means that she's like, like being held captive in VR or something. <laughs> You're not being held captive by anybody, are you? Are you okay, Lucy? There's nobody like got you chained up, right? No. Are you, are you mining bitcoins thing? with your VR <laughs> audio? <laughs> Oh maybe. no, maybe. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> oh, oh no, Bitcoins and VR. We're sorry. <laughs> I know it takes a lot of energy to do that here. <laughs> I know. <laughs> She's... Yeah. Are you frustrated? Are you Are you hopeful? There's more people on the dance floor. Are you waiting for people? <laughs> are you coming down from a <laughs> fentanyl high? Uh... <laughs> Are you in a K hole? Yeah, are you in a K hole? Old school K -hole? Are you an old school K hole? Oh, look at that. Oh, you are in a K hole. Oh, it's throwing a oh, boy. Oh, 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 snowball. Yeah, those frozen K holes. That'd be crazy. You gotta be careful with that ketamine. Yeah. You can get uh -huh. testing, t t okay, testing strips on Amazon now. Hey! I, I don't know if he's squirting on she's squirting on me or what. Uh, this is icy squirt. <laughs> <laughs> well, Lucy, uh, I hope you enjoy your K hole and uh, make sure you do some other drugs too. Yeah, yeah. Lucy is wonderful to meet you. I appreciate you being guardian of this place. This is kind. You're doing a wonderful job. <laughs> Hi, Lucy. <laughs> It's okay. Is everything oh gonna God, be sorry. okay now? <laughs> oh, you got a little tooth. You got a little little fang tooth right there. That's okay. You can see everything's gonna be fine. Oh, you got a little star. Mm. Oh, you should see this girl's pupil. She's definitely k holing right visual. now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I thought that might be the case, Lucy. Oh, I'm sorry. It's terrible when you get in a K-hole like that. You just don't feel like anything. <laughs> no, you just got to sit. Pretend it's a giant speaker. And you're in SF or New York. K-hole central. <laughs> K-hole central. Uh, here, Lucy, maybe I could just take you on a little ride. Oh, God. <laughs> Here, get on my hand, Lucy. Get on my hand, Lucy. Background as well. Lucy, jump on my hand, Lucy. <laughs> no, Lucy, you're not feeling <laughs> it. I'm sorry. Ah, oh, Lucy. <laughs> Lucy doesn't want to. <laughs> you don't want to ride. Eon, what are you Look, glitching out for? Eon Flex up there. Oh wow. Yeah. You can actually pick people up. Oh, I can see up my skirt. Yeah, you're missing out. <laughs> oh no! Oh, 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 oh. wow! Wow! Oh. That's intense, dude. 
Look at my skirt. Whoops, now I'm doing shit. <laughs> now you're K-Holing in, Gom. What's, what the no, hell? <laughs> I think her pupils did that to me. She, she, she transferred her K-hole. Wow. Have you been here a long time, Lucy? You want us oh, to call anybody? Oh, there's an escalier. I haven't seen it. You want us to call Oh. <laughs> what oh, happened? Uh, wow. Did, I, oh, did somebody dope. speak? Who was that? Sorry, I did something. Who did this? Oh, look, dope. Look up in the sky. Look at that face. Well, that's always been there. Whoa, whoa. What the fuck? What do you mean? Oh, shit. Hi. An an like a massive Hi. anime girl here previously. <laughs> Hi. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Oh, I can see it up. Where are you from, Lucy? Uh, upper. Uh, nose. Sausage. Uh. That's uncomfortable. Hmm. Hmm. Well, you know what time Lucy, it is? She's just happy in her it's, K-hole. It's time for Lucy to get out of this K-hole and start being a man. Come on, Lucy. We all believe in you. Let me do a little dance for you. All right? Here we go. Well. <laughs> I can't dance by myself. I need your help. Come on, dance with me. Aww. I'll give you some pizza. Are you the, are you the clock from Don't Hug Me Not Scared? <laughs> from what? Don't Don't Hug Me I'm Scared. No, you don't know what time it is. Maybe you should get Disney Plus. <laughs> Maybe you should figure that out, okay? All right. <laughs> All right. I don't know how to pull up my emotes anymore. <laughs> I really don't Got know the pizza. how. Yeah, I turned off that. Pizza's good for a K hole, Lucy. It's really Eat the good. Pizza. It's You'll really pull good. It's really good. It's really good. Lucy. All right. Oh, I don't know Lola. how. I don't know how to put Sorry, up a moat. I don't know Hi. how to put up a moat. What's up, Kim? Up, We're trying to help Lucy What's out up? of her keyhole. <laughs> oh no! You don't bend backwards. You're gonna fall. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's some real keyhole talk back. right there. I don't even know what that means. <laughs> Don't mean that. <laughs> no. Oh, could be dangerous. You could don't call it Kim K hole for nothing. Oh, Kim K hole, <laughs> what have you gotten a son to? Uh, <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna dance well, for her it? anyway. Nice. I'm gonna dance for her anyway. I want to give her a good dance. All right. I'm gonna Do give her a. Are you still Here we the go. Game? I'm dancing for her, giving the love that she needs. It, you. Giving her the love she's that she's crying. Giving her the love Let me give you a hug. Hey. Out, out of the K-hole. Hey, I'll dance it's for okay. you more. I'm going to dance for you. Over and over again. <laughs> you got to get in it. You can't okay. hold. How are you? You can't do it. <laughs> you can't do it. Hi, Yonder. Yes, you oh, oh my goodness. I'm good. How are you? You know what? You oh, seem like somebody that good. enjoys Club Just Penguin. Wonderful. I'll give you a Club okay. Penguin dance. Hi, um, hi. Hello, hey, Kim. <laughs> 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 hey, Kim. Yeah, you like it. Yeah, you like it. Club Penguin dance. You always make your hand. Yep, yep. Keep going, I'm keep going, going. <laughs> going to dance yourself right I'm out gonna, of that cable. I'm gonna dance all day. I'm gonna dance all night. To I'm gonna dance, dance all day and night and dance and dance and dance. Come on, Lucy, dance, dance, dance out of the cable. We can do it. We can do it. I'm gonna dance all day and night. Woo. I'm gonna dance, 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 Dance on the dance on the cable. Gonna dance on the cable. Everybody's gonna be alright. 
Dance, 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 dance all day and night. Get you out of the home, you're going to be in. Where's the North Carolina? Where's the North Carolina? Where's the North Carolina? Where's the North Carolina? Oh my god, we got the North Carolina. Here we go now. Here we go. Here we go. Boop, boop. Here we go. Boop, boop, boop. Here we go. Go, 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 go. Yeah, out of the K-hole, got some no cam. Everybody's happy. Everybody happy. Everybody happy. I'm a floss for this bitch. <laughs> oh, you don't like it. You don't like it. I got stuff. I, I got to do the super nanny. Whoa. Whoa, here we go. Whoa, whoa, here we go. Whoa, whoa. Oh, oh, here, we go. Uh, oh, here we go. You know. He's doing a happy dance, oh, oh, you Lucy. Oh, 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 all right. Your cable should be all gone now. Now, it should be all gone. Do the sprinkler. Oh, I'm going to do the <laughs> smug dance. Because that's how I feel that she is treating me. After I dance all these dances for her. All right. I think Lucy's real. I think Lucy's real, too. I think she's real. I believe in Lucy. I think she's real. Experiencing a K-hole. I think she's real. I think she's real. Lucy is awesome. I like Lucy. I think she's real. Can you... Can you I click on her? She's, she's in so. 3D. I think she's... Oh. Uh, uh, birthday player. I just died in your arms like tonight. Must have been so sad. <laughs> I could have walked away. I could have walked away. For some reason. But then I became... <laughs> like, select a person but then like you would. I become a zombie. Thriller. You gotta pull up the first. I'm going to make a baby. If I don't, I'll make a rat. I'll go go thriller. Thriller, Ned. If I'm going to make a baby, it's going to be a baby. Lucy, she gets out of the K-ho. Thriller. Thriller, Ned. I'm going to make a baby. All right, I'm done. I can't do it anymore. <laughs> I, uh, I have uh, tried you to. You did good, K Hole. I've tried, I mean, uh, Lucy. To, I've tried to cheer yeah. up. Um, don't know what else I can I like how it, bring to I this. No, she sends you love. Uh, just Thank you. Home. Thank you. I am going to uh, be a flat Thank chested you, Wendy now just to calm everyone down a little. Oh, no. Where'd the babies go? Hey, Lucy. Ah, she's well, enjoy your night. Yeah, have a good night. Try just try just to cheer you up. Uh, I guess uh, I guess we'll send you a friend request, and you can join us in the adventures in the future. Uh, once you come out of that K hole, you can hang out with us. Right? Yeah, okay. we go on lots of adventures all over the place. Yeah. <laughs> You'll love it. <laughs> it's exciting. And new. All right. All right. Let's go ahead here. All right. Uh, first thing I want to do, guys, I want to, like, definitely save this world. This world is awesome. Of your running character. Save world. Definitely. Not make home. Already, all right. Already favored this world, I guess. Um... Yeah, no, I haven't put it on mine yet. All right, it's let's go cool. to... I like the fact they're upgrading I'll, I'll this as well. I'll send you a picture. Yeah. I'll send you a picture. Yeah. Yeah. Is Boba here? Yeah. No. Yeah, he's here. Where's Boba? Oh, there he is. He's been in the bathroom masturbating. Um... <laughs> <laughs> he told me he was going to jerk one off. Oh, my God. <laughs> What the hell was that? <laughs> Jesus I think we can't get the allergic to masturbation. Uh, it, it, he's allergic to masturbation. All right, let's go to Dino World. I need to get some ice for my drink, but let's go see some dinosaurs. Mm. Ice, ice. We now have access to the custom avatar system. Nice. Ice.
Ooh, you could jump good here. Oh my god. Oh, there's a Feed Me Seymour over here. Feed Me Seymour! I like the jumpies, Joe. not going to be good for my stomach. Oh, my God. Can you jump on one of these ter ter pterodactyls? Oh, no. <laughs> I'm at the I'm jumping to you. Oh, no. I'm going to jump. Oh, look, there's, a, there's some Venus flytraps over there. Great. Oh, God. I jumped onto the Venus flytrap and fell through the I don't know if I'd recommend it. Oh, did he? Is everyone frozen? Nope. Uh. Alright, I'm gonna grab some ice. Let's uh, smoke some weed, I guess, and then go somewhere else. And then... Hey, little Shepard Horace behind you. Yeah, I saw him. I said that exact thing. Jesus. <laughs> I did the uh, I did the neti pot thing. Did y'all ever fuck with the neti pot? Feel good after? Yeah. Okay, so it was nice. It was like, uh, you know, it pulls out all the shit that you can't get out by just blowing on your nose. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Boba did it. It opens your third eye. Right on the pterodactyl. It off, yeah, it does. No. Your third <laughs> gateway is further down. Museum things down there. It's not what I wanted. Anybody else get bad uh, frame rates? Um, I'm getting about... Forty, thirty, thirty, thirty six. Top frames. Yeah. Yeah, this world's definitely not optimized well. So how do I change my side as size? Is that a world specific thing or uh, avatar, right? To your avatar, yeah. Yeah, but like if I've got a tiny ass avatar that I found, mm -hmm. can, is there any way to make yeah. it bigger or no? No, it's just the avatar, yeah. They had done a lot of updates though. Maybe. Oh, so, way. so when Ben was massive, he just literally had a massive model that he imported. Yeah, yeah he's got several. Yeah. Uh, oh, okay. You Maybe. could for sure build it into a model, but like as far yeah, as I was like wondering if I was gonna have to bother with that because I I wanted to make my profile picture thing, but uh, it's a it's a tad small. <laughs> mm. I rode the dinosaur. Kind of <sighs> if you sit down, you, your legs just kind of merge. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Be one with the dinosaur. There's some Dinosaur Venus flytraps over there. Uh, yeah, there's some museums them. down over that way. I don't know. Check them out. I saw a patch of begonias over there by that triceratops. Moon man, moon man, can't you see? <laughs> Fuck this frame rate. Wow, we gotta do something. Whoa. Is my computer plugged in? Oh my god. <laughs> Too much slidiness in this world. <laughs> I tell you what, you sure can jump high in here. Hey, 
Yeah, the frames here are uh, definitely interesting that we were getting like way better performance at that other place. God, why can't I jump? Oh my god, that scared the <laughs> I walked forward in real life and fell off the fucking pterodactyl and scared the shit out of myself. <laughs> that was terrifying. Film acting and stuff? He's from Houston. Oh, yeah. really? and, oh cool, yeah, yeah. cool. Yeah, he worked with he a lot of directed a lot, didn't he? Yeah, he's doing that now, doing a lot of production and uh, and directing. He did the old, the and, original, uh, the, the, um, he directed yeah, a lot of episodes yeah, yeah, yeah. too, didn't he, of Next Generation? Cool. Yeah, I believe so. Yeah, he's he's a, a, a really nice person, so. Your avatar kind of looks like him. Jonathan Frakes. Yeah, I always thought when I was a kid, I was like, I'm probably going to end up looking like him. <laughs> older. You know, just a fatter <laughs> guy with a beard. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Man, it's so cool that they all got those, uh, especially that that whole crew. Like you know, we Yo, got man, I got a belt. Why? You can get some real world yeah, shit done. Ah, I got a heap of real real world shit going on. I got like. No. Ah! Okay, what happened to your yesterday? Uh, you had a monitor like die. Is that what happened? Yeah, yeah, the backlight died on my monitor, so I went and got another one. Got another Pretty monitor good. or got backlight? HD. No, another monitor. <laughs> the, it's the backlight in the monitor that oh, died. So yeah. basically, I had this wicked gradient from the top of the screen down. Oh god. Um. Wait, what? Uh, what monitor yeah, did you get? So I got a. F 
Uh, gigabyte Azorus 43 inch 4K. Cool. Um, What's the refresh rate? Yeah, I, I want uh, 144 at the moment. That's good. All right, I'll see you later. One that you might like. Jonah Hill and Emma Stone. Uh, I have more. And, I have uh, more monitors than I need. Like right now, I have like. I'll post a uh, monitors in my hallway. Post a photo on the Discord of these. Uh, you got the Samsung, but there's a Samsung G5, which has a one millisecond and a one meter radius. Um, I'll, they're two and a half grand Australian. No, I, no, a, no, that's I'll, what I'll I got. Post this rig. You got the G5? Yeah. Oh fuck you, yeah, man. <laughs> Yeah, it's not great. It, oh, well, it's got a lot of problems. Uh, I'm on my like uh, fifth uh, firmware upgrade since I got it. It does a lot of th like things where like when you're moving things around, it, it like flashes and stuff, like flashing. And uh, it's all right for gaming and stuff. I mean, it's great for gaming, but okay. like for other uses, like uh, yeah, yeah, no, no, just like like anything other than gaming. It's got a lot of flashing issues where it's it like if you drag like a window across the screen, it starts like flashing a little, like very mild. Like it's very not a huge issue, but still, it's like no, this should be smoother. You know, uh, it's all right. Yeah, that sounds like a driver issue with yeah. Nvidia. Oh yeah, yeah. No, it's uh, mm. it's it's they're 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 fixing it slowly. It's kind of like everything nowadays. We're all the beta testers, so they'll release this expensive monitor and you get to beta test it for him. It's kind of annoying. Hmm. Alrighty, peeps. I gotta get in and see some invoicing. I'll All catch right. you guys on flip side. Bye. See you later. Bye. Well, we definitely need to go somewhere Bye. else. This place sucks. Uh, yeah, I keep crashing in here. Really? Oh, I, I keep on falling off the side. Yeah, that's so. weird. Um, well, this looks interesting. I don't know what this is. Let's try this. What if God was one of us? I got two. <laughs> oh, hey, it's the rain from Grand Theft Auto. Uh, <laughs> that's exactly what it is, but this is easier to see through. Like, granted, when the rain started, like, it literally was this. It was like a joke. Like, it makes me really wonder what the fuck Rockstar was thinking. What is going on here? Yeah, I don't know. Oh, I guess this is where you stand a trip. Dude, this looks like an Intel commercial. <laughs> like, this coming soon for Intel. <laughs> We're taking Pinium to the next level. Celeron 2. <laughs> looks like a Lego Star Wars intro. AMD can't render this. All right. <laughs> Well, I don't know about that. AMD is way ahead of Intel right now. I got the yeah, well, 5950, uh, and uh, I've been seeing a lot of tests test against the new Intel uh, chips. And I mean, they just, they're barely out right now, but it's still holding. It's pretty good, man, for most shit. If, yeah, I mean that that's the processor is going to be killer for years to come, no right. doubt. But I am I was pleased to see Intel at least like punching back a little bit because I, yeah. I just want competition because the better, yeah. better more competition means they're just going to keep. You know, but the the uh, the innovating and the know. wattage and the heat is pretty out of control. Like it's not it's definitely yeah. a rush to market chip that isn't fine tuned because. That that it uses sure. so much wattage and he it gets so hot it's not good like those those chips aren't going to last that long you're gonna have to, they're gonna have to fine tune that shit. I mean from the tests I was seeing they, they they yeah they do use like up to 250 watts in yeah. some that's crazy processes but like, like 59, the, the cooling like, was AMD is like almost half cooling, yeah. or Apple is almost half it's, yeah of that. it goes up to like 125 150 yeah yeah. Um, 
but the dino, here. yeah, it's 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 going to be a different. Oh, it's a totally different yeah. architecture, but uh, <laughs> I'm excited to see them refine that and see yeah. how AMD responds because I'm yeah. going to get a new CPU maybe in the next in the few years because I've been waiting to see how well, they. I they think AMD is going to respond hardcore. I think AMD is like, oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. <laughs> uh, also, though, I think yeah. Apple's the way to go. Like th those new chips are just so amazing. Go on, that dude. Yeah, those are, are pretty solid. I'm getting yeah. Friday. I'm, uh, I'm Friday. I'm getting my M1 Max, whatever the highest oh, one. Dope. So I'll be testing that nice. out. Uh, oh, it yeah. it just makes me sad that I have a, you know, almost a fifty thousand dollar computer that that's going to get its ass kicked by this laptop that I got for four thousand or five thousand or something. Like that. <laughs> right. You know what I mean? Like it, it really kind of upsets me. Mm -hmm. But makes me, I'm okay with it because it's, I of course I want better, faster, everything, but it still upsets me that Apple probably knew about this when they released that thing. And you know what I mean? Like they probably already had that in development. Like it's kind of fucked up of Apple, I think. And I, I almost think that like if you have a Mac Pro, they should offer an upgrade to us that replaces the main board and the chip for like, five thousand dollars or something like that just or something like that you know what i mean like i yeah, don't know yeah. i can see it. yeah i can see it well but that's the thing is I'm, I'm, I'm curious to see how they're going to scale it up to like that desktop architecture because it started mm -hmm. as a mobile chip right? right and i think going to the laptops you know still low power uh, right. usage um but i want to see how that goes if you really give us some juice and they scale it up you know yeah i think they're just going to add multiple ones is what i think they're going to do you know what i mean i think they're just going to add like four mm -hmm. of them or I don't know, who knows? But I, I like I, like the afterburner thing. I mean, that was a two thousand dollar upgrade for the Mac Pro. Pretty much, these laptops just made that like useless. Like like that's just going to be a joke in like five years. Remember the afterburner cards they did? Uh, you know, like uh, where at the time it was like hell yeah, it helps out with like rendering and stuff like that. But now this chip does it all. Like this, it's ridiculous. There's a forest mm -hmm. down there. Is there? Flew yeah, all the way say, back up. He wasn't kidding. You can literally walk around <laughs> down there. It's not like a skybox. Yeah. Oh, really? I jumped. Yeah, I jumped yeah. down there and then flew back. Oh wow! Oh wow! That's cool. Frames. Yeah. yeah. I'm only getting thirty frames in here. Yeah. Yeah, frames. Yeah. What what frames <laughs> yeah, am I getting? Freeze rendered in for no reason. Where is the frames nowadays? Oh, I. Don't even see it. You now. can you can pin it actually. If you go to the, the, oh, it's uh, under uh, settings. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I'm getting twenty twenty two. It's getting seventeen. Always be on your main. You're getting seventeen. I'm getting twenty two. Oh, on a thirty ninety, I'm getting twenty two. Hilarious. <laughs> yeah, that's that's one bad thing about VR chat. All this shit's really unrefined and makes zero sense. Uh, I'm also getting my 22. Yeah. What's that? Oh, they're cool trees. I'm getting the same thing. Cool effect. Um, all right, let's go somewhere else. This is okay. Whoa, undersea home. What is this? Let's Under try this out. Sea. Um, actually, there's two incidences. What? All right, let's try this out. Yep. Wow. Here we go. I so mean, I yeah, <laughs> undersea home. This is like, <laughs> <laughs> this seems like the worst undersea home I've ever thought of. Wait, is there a mirror here? Cage. Yeah, this is undersea studio. This is a this. bad, this is bad. Uh, With views of nothing. Yeah, what are we looking at? There has to be more to this. Like something starts happening, like this starts leaking or something. Oh my God, can you imagine if we're in here and it starts slowly leaking and the water starts building up on the floor just slowly? And the the more the water builds up, the more like like hallucinations we start having because we're we're like sharing air. I'm sure this would be frame heavy. 
This is the seventh <laughs> Squid Game. And then we all get. I have COVID. a really cool world, um, but it's like a audio visual world. You go in and like it's like uh, they play like music and there's like lights that are coming all around. It's really fucking psychedelic as shit. Copyrighted music. Maybe sharks. <laughs> um, probably. Yeah. Yeah, I don't like either. Uh, yeah. Let's go to <laughs> somewhere else because this is too small. Um. Yeah, they need some painting, some spackling. I have yeah. a world. Wait, where is it? I have a world. Really? Major spackling. What is yeah. it? What is it? A whole new world. Unfortunately, Hold on, let me see if I can find it. All right, let's let's go here this while we're waiting while she's finding this. Oh man. Uh, All right, there's no there's no too close to spawn. Everyone follow me. All right. Whispering. And you can draw here. Oh, there's a mirror here. Hey, okay. There's a mirror over here and and art supplies. That's not bad. What's the sound like here? Oh, this is nice. Oh, it's a fall. Churchy. Oh, it's churchy. I like that. So I guess we're all going to hell. No. Uh, I want to draw. Let's all draw. God, that's really low, though. Get away from me. I see you. Where's that one rock? Oh, yeah, I want to draw Jesus. All right, let's draw Jesus, guys. Right when I said Jesus, Janice walked through the front door, and the ring camera went, bling, made the, uh, you know, the sound that ring cameras do. And the security systems, system said, front door open. Like, what if Jesus was coming through my front door and it wasn't Janice? Like, what would it? What it <laughs> Jesus is at the front right. door. He's selling something. <laughs> yeah, it's his what do you want, Jesus? Are you racist? All right. Uh, all right. Gonna make this one a thick boy. Ooh, he has warts on his penis. Yeah. The power of Christ compels you. <laughs> Your mother sucks cock and hell. Jesus. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> this music sounds like Because by the Beatles. <laughs> the world music off uh yeah it's i have it on right now very low and it's very annoying it's it lost <laughs> I like it, it. Look at i mean it's here, yeah like, man, that's always good <laughs> <laughs> yeah holy shit talk about what undefined are... i had to restart the game to see any of you on my friends list <laughs> oh really yeah that's how it happens <laughs> yeah. All right, that's a good penis. Let's see if uh, Kim can take this. Uh, can she take the whole thing? Mm -hmm. We'll find out. I think she can. Nice. I think she's got. You used can to, do it. She's used to pineapples. She's used to pineapples. She got this. Uh, by the way, a lot of people think that Kim does pineapple first. She actually does the stem in like the really sharp green yeah, the part. Pointy. yeah yeah she does that first <laughs> which i thought was interesting but she explained it really well on her podcast squirting with my <laughs> attorney uh <laughs> squirt attorney pointy squirt pubes. Pubes. and one two <laughs> yep she got it yep she got it all in there Good job. All right, now let's see if Yonder can do Thanks. it. Yonder, get in there. Let's see if you can get take that whole piece. All right. <laughs> get in there, Yonder. <laughs> Your fucking beard is so funny. Oh, wow, he's riding that shit. Oh, God, he got the balls in there, too. He got the balls in the dick. Oh, my God, how did he get it all in there? That's a Myrtle Beach thing, wow. I think. 
all. Yeah, that's like, you know. It's so much just by the way, out his front. He yeah. might have sold that shit to that K-hole girl. You know what I'm, now the more I think about it. <laughs> like, like, if he's doing this with a dick, he probably, he's probably responsible to, for the for that K-hole. He right. roofied her. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Mark, your turn. Yeah, you, you, Get you in there, Mark. Oh, all sure. right, all right, Mark. I feel like Mark's gonna be romantic about it. Yep. Okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's gonna get. Yeah, yeah, yeah he's gonna get. Yeah. He's gonna get. Oh wow, wow, he's very <laughs> medical. <laughs> very <laughs> medical. <laughs> yeah. He's doing a back medical. Little, yeah, back yeah. Now yeah, just back it up a little. Back it up. Oh, now too fast. Wow, wow, he just fell in there. I guess fell in there. Well, he is from Los Angeles. That's good technique, Mark. I mean that kind. Kind of work. Yep. Yeah. All right. All right. Mark, get out of there. We don't need any more of that. That's horrible. All right. Best butt in the business, Eon. Let's see you get in there. I mean, you got like that fucking sloppy ass. I feel like you're gonna be really like good. Gonna, like, yeah. I feel like it's really gonna be in there. there. Look at that sloppy ass. Fucking get that Lord, cheese. Lord, I want to take this opportunity cheese. to apologize and ask for forgiveness. By the way, by the way, by the way, look how fast his tail's wagging right now. Eon's tail's wagging harder than ever right now. It's a highway to hell with this one. Eon's tail's wagging so fast. Like he's re- all right. I guess that's what that was it. Uh, Eon's a gentle lover. But I didn't know that was a thing. All right, blueberry buttons, get in there. Let me let me see what daddy daddy does. All right. Yeah. Quick and easy. Well, damn. Uh, Quick and easy. I don't know if I can get in there. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta pull up your raincoat a little or something. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh wow he's tickling on there it's all the same here we go oh he's doing the beauty and the bad be- beauty and the beast dance oh now he wanted to <laughs> now he went to oh damn oh whoa what the fuck oh he did oh oh now he's doing a- akuma matata on it what the fuck Fuck oh. <laughs> now he's Snow White and Seven it's Dwarfs. Oh, oh, that was a great oh. exit. That was a great exit. That was that was amazing. Ooh, boy, that was a good one. That was a good one. That was a good one. All right, uh, <laughs> Mr. Magoo, I guess it's your turn now. Oh shit. Uh, get in there. See. All right. Head right. backflip onto the stick. Oh, okay. Here we go. Whoa! He backflipped into the dick. Oh, now he's riding it and kissing the top of it. He's drinking Mountain Dew Surge. Oh, he, 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 what? He gave it some roses. Wow. Uh, damn, damn. That's, that was actually pretty amazing. In and out. You know, that's the best part. That was, that was awesome. All right. Well, good job, everyone. All right, let's take Turn let's take a knee one. and uh, pray. We all don't die. Yeah, let's give. <laughs> God we're forgiveness. Gonna repent our sins. Sorry, God. Yeah. Pray to the penis. I'm able to take Dear the asshole. Father, we come to you today in Jesus' in name to yeah. ask for forgiveness <laughs> for all of these poor souls. <laughs> Forgive them, Father, for they know not what they've Glad done. Glad that's on video. Hail <laughs> <laughs> Mary, full of grace. Hey, I'm so glad this is a stream on YouTube. This is... <laughs> uh, by the way, uh, we should probably get out of here. Look how many... I don't know if you guys saw the stained glass windows. It's pretty much every single god ever looking at you guys. So even if you don't believe in one Jesus, it's, it's all the Jesuses. It's like a Pokemon collection. Why did you guys do that? Notice how I didn't do it? Notice how I didn't do it? I just drew it. I was drawing, I was drawing a beautiful penis for you, my friends. But you guys, you weren't supposed to fuck it. You were supposed to, like... Make food for your family and like survive. Well, see, it's love yeah. over here. All right. No. See, love is perfect. Is kind. Does not envy. Asian words slash local. Yeah, this is First Corinthians me. chapter thirteen. God, you could stop waving your butt tail any time now, Eon. Can't help it. He's got that love tat on the back too. 
and then look at it also pulsates every time. Well, I, have you ever thought about changing your avatar? Or are you just <laughs> that much in the anal and milk? Oh my god! <laughs> like, like what? Oh, yeah, what? yeah. He's got like a backwards heart in that buttocks. Oh my god! Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold that's, on. A, that's just a cream pie. Uh, yep, he's on the cake. I bet you it would be very exciting. That's not Kate Quigley. Oh, oh wait, wait maybe. Milk. Oh wait, you didn't say Kate. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell, oh, yonder? <laughs> yonder had a support application <laughs> happening in the church <laughs> today. Uh, all right, let's go somewhere else. Told me in front of this avatar, so I switched out of it. Uh, Boba, you got a place? <laughs> Uh, I'm looking stuff up. Wait, who was who was who? Uh, or Kim, you had a place. Do you find the place? Yeah, no, it doesn't. It doesn't exist anymore. Oh well, that had to be illegal. Oh my god. Uh, I could choose some place. I'll choose a random place if you guys don't find it before I do. Oh, what's this one? How about this? Guess this wrestling thing. What's on? You guys like wrestling? I don't. But maybe you guys do. Guess this wrestling theme. What about, what about this one? All right, let's go to Kim's. Oh, it looks like a weed grow house apartment. Nice. With some drugs and a couch. Yeah, this is like where you go when you uh, definitely want to uh, grow some weed. Oh, oh wait, yeah. you can. Oh, you can make oh, potions what the fuck here. Is this? Oh, you can make potions <laughs> here. Oh, uh, hell potions. yeah! Of course, Kim knows about what? this place. <laughs> Kim's like, this is what my gets my butthole numb when all the, I put, the I island boys there. come to my I'll butt. No. I have all these potions. Get my butthole numb. Yo, is Tom Hanks on here? <laughs> <laughs> leave Tom Hanks' son alone, man. I, everyone needs to leave him alone. <laughs> Here's all that anger on uh. Saturday Night Live or something. <laughs> Bucket in the yeah, Bubba. Smoking it up. Oh, yeah. Oh, I put oh, wait, did I get it? Dinner. All right, huh? And the water. Oh, there's oh, a screen up here. Nice. Hey, no, hey, no, wait, wait, wait. I was doing something. Pour this in there. I just Super hit something in my room. Shit. There's a lot more I shit out oh, here. Oh, I'm hitting the, my closet door. Fuck, I gotta move. Yep, yeah, this room's purple. It's <laughs> too. Don't go back in. Uh, <laughs> come on, Kim. I never went in. There. It's been a plant. I planted it. Oh, there you go. Look at that. That's adorable. <laughs> oh, with the COVID cough, it's going to be really good. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, put a lot in there. Did you put Jack Daniels in there? Damn. <laughs> Helps the weeds grow. Hell yeah. It says in two minutes it'll grow. Okay. I wonder if it's a one nice. use nice. thing. Uh, or if it's like we all. Yeah, this is creative. You know, uh, if we all get to use it, that would be better. Uh, mm -hmm. Yonder's upstairs and he's like, hey guys, I've come across something. Uh, oh, it's there's see there's a child farm up here you guys need to know about. Yeah. <laughs> there's a video player. Oh, yeah. look, a car. There's a, yeah, there's a. What the hell? This is un unexpected. <laughs> like, there's like an outdoor. There's soil creation. <laughs> is this where we're supposed to go out and like trip on acid? Like, what if they just gave you like a there's place a to trip on acid? You know, like, oh, what the hell? Uh, there's a joint oh, yeah, rolling a station in there. in there. Yeah, cool. What? Where's all the weed? Oh, my God. So can you actually, oh. does this actually do shit? Like, if, if you combine these things? Yeah. It? 
Will it, it do things? I think so. It's got yeah. the blender. Yeah, I it's made floating. the plant. I made the plant. All right. Well, it's let's go eat. check on that. Oh, is it growing? It's dead. Yeah, no, I keep that thing on me. I have a lighter here. Here we go. Oh, oh my God, it works. <laughs> you going to eat it? Can you eat it or anything? You better grow, yeah. motherfucker. You better grow. Hasn't well, grown yet? Yeah. Hasn't grown yet? You better it says grow. Did you oh, I need to water it. Did you squirt oh, in there's it? There's a water bucket right here. Oh, it doesn't but there's no, wa there's no one. Oh, oh my god, you gotta get water. water. One, uh, oh god, that's so annoying. <laughs> you could use Jack Daniels, probably. I got it. I got the water. And then. There we go. Oh, there it goes. Look. Yeah, I did it. Yeah. Oh, you and Tom Hanks' son, man. Two, you must have fucked that dude. Two minutes and 30 seconds. Yep, then we need to use the, need to use the knife. The oh, look, you can Trim see it. it growing. Look, look at it. It's moving. Uh, yeah, that's what she said. Oh, it is growing. That's cool. <laughs> it's growing. It's <laughs> growing. Uh, it keeps on farting. Don't light it up. Don't do it. No. Don't what do are you it. Doing? Leave it. Let it grow. <laughs> this is life, man. Bluetooth.com. Unfortunately, in Texas, we have to abort it right now. So I'm going to have to put this on fire and uh... torch it. Get some support in there. Torch the baby. I mean, we can tie the plant to that whiskey bottle, make sure it won't tilt. I found a jug of water out there. Hey, oh, what not bad. What are you doing, man? Oh, I think it's Pow. I think it's time. I accidentally so. picked it up. All right, now sit on it. Yeah, now fuck okay. it. Yeah, now, to talk now to fuck it. the shit out of that. <laughs> yeah. yeah, get in there. Oh, it's get in there. Yeah, it's growing in you. Oh, you're dying. It's getting in your brain. No, it's growing too long. Oh, you can't. It's going to hurt you. All right. All right, now we can all fuck her body. And no, she's not going to say no. Uh, <laughs> okay, get. You got to get the knife. Oh, there it is. All right. Cut it, cut it. You ready? Is it ready? Yeah. Thing. Oh, I don't sorry. know. Yeah, it's still growing. Still growing. Yeah, it's still moving. Yeah, it's still moving. When it starts getting brown, it start. It still moves. <laughs> Lowest erection ever. So it says, yeah, when yeah, it starts it says, getting oh, brown, call the police. Yeah, how'd they get oh. over here? Huh? All right, like yeah, I would, I would here. cut it now. Okay, if I, I think was it's you. done. Uh, yeah, I would say yeah. it's done. Yeah, cut it. What's going on over here, though? What the fuck is? Hey, we're trying to do drugs. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh look, yeah, you're cutting no, it out. Uh, no, he did. I saw no, you. I think that's. I think it's. I think it's budding. It's still growing. Oh, oh wait, see, yeah, now I can use it. Yeah. Oh, there. See, look, there's turds on the ground. <sighs> All right. Turd buds. Oh, yeah. Right. Eat, eat, that turd. Buds. eat that turd. Eat that Give turd. Eat that turd. Give me that doo doo. Give me that doo doo. This this guy. Uh, this little nugget here. Get in here, Maddie. Are those seeds? Oh wait, or this is yeah, this is another seed. Yeah, never mind. I got is there a bong here? Oh, there's bongs on the bottom. Get those bongs. Oh, Wait, yeah. I saw a bong somewhere. Like right there's bongs. Like yeah, put the put the weed in the bong. Uh, oh, you think we have to grind it first? To yeah, I think so. All right. Oh, I don't think so. Just put it yeah, in the bong. A blender. Just put it in the bong. There's a blender in the other room. There's a blender right here. It's not where's working. The bong? Right here on the table. It might. We might have to take it up to the lab where those two um, blenders were that said grinder on them. This is so much work. There's like more work. So than much work. Necessary here. Right. <laughs> Let's see. All right. Up to the lab. All right. I think that's harvested. Does this? Uh, yeah. What's that do that? You got yeah, all the buds on the plant. ground. Those are poops. It can't be dry. Was that your your kitty cat? It's on the video on Boop. What? I see something different. I, I see electrodes. Well, it's about to. 
There no, it goes. No, that's that not my cat. That's not my cat. Uh, when I was that a one that here. show and tell that that girl did. <laughs> when I when I was a I kid, when I was a kid, I saw that. Wait, wait, how did you do it? Oh, you got weed now. Wait, All right, wait, put it in the bong. Yo, it's following yeah. you. Wait, hold on, I'm flying around. I know. Where'd it go? Uh, I think no, it's on the f floor. Oh, here we go. I think Eon's taking a hit. It's on the table. Eon's taking oh, a there hit. You go. Oh. Yeah. <coughs> Eon! Awesome. Mm -hmm. All right. I'll take a hit. I'll take a hit. It's cashed. It is? Oh, man. Oops. Here's that lighter. Mm -hmm. All right. It's cast though. Oh shit! Yeah, I don't right. know what that makes. <sighs> never mind. Never mind. Fill that oh, bong up for me. We can make more soil. VR bong. Is it in yeah, there? Did you get it? It's not in there. Here, here. Oh, hey, hey, grab, grab a nugget. This is so much fun. <laughs> grab, grab a nugget and come to this joint rolling station, please. Hold on. He's gonna this put. So it. He's, awesome. gonna He's gonna put a turd in my. All right. Hold on. How do I... <laughs> well, no, you gotta grind it up first. Oh my god! Yeah, the joint, oh, there's a blender upstairs. Here, here, there's a blender. Yeah, yeah, come over here. Nah, here's some more, fuck this. Awesome. Here's some more. Here. Oh wait, where? Hi, uh, right here in my hand. There's so much going on. Nice. All right, where's that bong at? Here's a bong. Yeah. Don't Jones that bong. Jesus Christ. <laughs> all right, so I got the... There, oh, all right, drop it. the weed. Oh, it's in there? No, it's in it, yeah. Yeah? Mm -hmm. All right. How do I... <laughs> yeah, there you go. Wow. Oh, yeah. I'm just fucking smoking, baby. Smoking, yeah. Oh, thanks. Yeah, I got a bong pack. Hey. Oh, I need the lighter. Hey, do you guys want to just, hey. like, like, uh. like, touch each other's elbows and imagine that they're feet? Uh, you guys. Yeah, dude. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, here, I'll light your bong. Here. I made a joint hey. this time. Okay. Oh. Like I made a joint this time. Oh, he made a joint. Yeah. Light uh. that shit up, man. Yeah. yeah. It's fucking oh, shit. crazy. Damn. <laughs> I like this place. <laughs> Yo, smoking heroin. Fuck yeah. <laughs> oh, God. Okay. Go. Favorite. Appreciate. Thank you, buddy. Ooh, doggy. Actually, we should actually smoke in real time <laughs> while we do this. <laughs> Blueberry buttons is gonna tell on us. He's hiding under the stairs. Blueberry, don't tell on us. You. You're all in trouble. I'm gonna tell mom. <laughs> He's gonna nart. Blueberry, <laughs> you better not tell mom. You better not tell mom. You better stop. Just say no. Why are you hiding like that? Just say no. That's so funny. Look at Blueberry hiding behind. I swear to God, you tell mom. You better not tell mom. Shut up. Get Don't tell here. mom, man. You guys are all busted. <laughs> you're gonna all get whipped. I'm gonna show mom where you're, your you're in for a spanking. Dude. Blueberry, uh, stop! Don't care, I got them from her. They're all lesbian magazines. Oh my God, Blueberry, you made me chip my tooth. That's hilarious. I need a lighter though. Where's my lighter? Is that? Oh, here's one. The flow. What does that voice keep saying? And this is the kid who got into what? When he what? I have that shit turned down. Don't do it. Are you, um, Ryan, are you Me? producing Willie, William Montgomery's no. thing? No, no. Me and William uh, were supposed to do a podcast a million times. And he mm -hmm. just never, never would like, it was a nightmare. Like he would never like, mm. hey, let's do this. And then he wouldn't like text back or whatever. 
And then there was a oh, point where I was just like, just I'm kind it. of over this. And then he's just like, hey, I got a new podcast. Mm-hmm. I'm like, okay, all right, whatever, dude. Mm. Yeah, I uh, yeah. wish him well. I, w- I wish him it? well, but it's pretty annoying because <laughs> literally I've been trying yeah. to do a podcast with him since I moved out here, like almost a year. Like, and I'm mm-hmm. like, oh, I'm done. Mm-hmm. Yep, yep. Well, you're talking about it before he even moved out here. Yeah. 100 percent yeah yeah i've been on team william since day one tried to help him out obviously somebody like hey we can make you a podcast you know like whatever we can make you a superstar <laughs> yeah exactly so yeah. good luck yeah. to him but also i don't give a fuck you know i uh i don't give a mm-hmm. fuck anymore <laughs> yeah Yeah, that sucks, dude. Because, I mean, if anybody was ever gonna make a podcast that was like, like really good friends with you, like William, you'd be the guy to go to. <laughs> Literally, did a podcast with like him for a year. Person. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, like had a great idea for his podcast. Somebody else, like, I think, like, just kind of like you know creepily got in there and yeah yeah yeah, yeah. and uh yeah, yeah, yeah. i don't give a fuck because yeah. i'm really busy already all that shit's just extra fun stuff like help a friend out do it right and uh if i'm not there i don't give a fuck you know i don't care good luck good luck yep yep the only positive thing thing i said to william recently was like hey just ma- make sure you don't get fucked and uh because all these yeah, people yeah. are they're doing it for a reason you know yeah <laughs> money man yeah <laughs> money 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 <laughs> they want that percentage you know <laughs> yeah i do like that william had today he had like a teaser trailer that came out and uh mm-hmm. Literally, the whole thing is exactly what I've been doing on Kill Tony lately. Joking about smash that like button, smash that like. Yeah, I'm like, and that's his <laughs> yeah. teaser trailer was exactly the same shit I've been joking about on Kill Tony the last couple of weeks. <laughs> <laughs> it was. <laughs> I yeah. thought it was like a full episode thing. Like, no. it fooled me. Yeah. <clears throat> we got in like over a hundred, a hundred subs off of that little post there. So great job, roll tide. Great roll tide for that job. Great fuck. Hey, smoke some more weed uh, yonder. <clears throat> I'm smoking weed right now. Oh, shit, yeah. See, that <laughs> <laughs> That's a pretty good idea. I can go for some more. My shit's really like fucking uh, clogged again. Man, I need to just fuck these bongs. These bongs are always clogged. Make an uncloggable like bong. bong right? Yeah, but it's clogged after yeah. day two. Like, legit. Oh. <laughs> you can't was... fix the clogged shit. Shit's always gonna be clogged. My, uh, my Grateful Dead yeah, pipe. Yeah. I never smoke out of that. Um, so this would be a cool world if all the shit you did actually affected like you in the game, like gave you yeah. trails or something or, you know, or something. This seems yeah, like a place a that would up. do that, but it doesn't. That's kind of sucks. What if it is and we're just high in real life and can't tell? <laughs> oh yeah. Right. <laughs> I, I, yeah. Or... Where it's too high to like actually figure like, oh, you guys didn't actually inhale it. You have to like put it up to your mouth and actually do the motions of inhaling. You know what I mean? Right. <coughs> like there's one person that goes, dude, you, you don't know how to smoke weed. It's so fucking windy outside right now. Yeah, it's I've got my balcony windy. door open. It's always yeah, windy. I got my balcony door open. I'm 
My door. Dude, we live at the we live at the top of a hill in our little community, so it's the windiest at our house. Oh, dude, you don't know. You don't understand windy. Like that's one thing, by the way. Never like you always hear like what the windy city, Chicago or something, but you never hear about yeah. wind in Texas. That's the first thing I noticed when I first moved here. Like, holy shit, this wind is legit. Like, it's constantly oh, uh, windy. Yeah. I have a question my boyfriend wants to ask you guys. All right. Um, does any of you wear Lululemon? What's that? Uh, what's that? It's like I have a, one pair of like, Lululemon shorts. Lululemon. We have one pair of Lululemon shorts. Everyone else said, what's that? Is that okay? Of shorts? He's trying to do you stocks. Like or he's No, he's trying to short their stocks or something. I don't know. So he wants to know if anyone <laughs> wears shorts. Yeah, no, 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 real, real men something. don't wear Lululemons. <laughs> so if that helps you. Yeah, Brian, said, Brian said real men don't wear Lululemon. <laughs> He agrees. He agrees. Most men do La Target or La Amazon. Massimo. Massimo. Fruit of the Loom. Maybe a Macy's here and there. I don't know if you know about men's clothing. There ain't anything going on with men's clothing. It's either a t-shirt and jeans or a hoodie and jeans or a sweater jean. That's well, it. We don't this, got beautiful dresses, all right? I guess this it company is like athletic yep. wear or yoga pants and stuff. It's a, but it's mostly I've seen a lot of memes like middle about the girls. women. Yeah, I've seen a lot of memes where yeah. girls' asses improved tenfold in those Lululemon things. Mm. But there's, he so says that their stock thing. is... Their stock right now is worth more than Microsoft. Ew. So he's wondering why. Oh. Uh, <laughs> well, I think oh. there's been a lot of, uh, you know, money. Gay money <laughs> spent. I don't know how to do stocks. I mean, they're not. Mm-hmm. I think once gay guys aren't spending money on AIDS medicine, they have all this extra cash. Uh, once they realize AIDS <laughs> wasn't real. <laughs> Uh, just kidding. Yeah, it's just real. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> I'm just kidding. That was a joke. That was a bad joke. <laughs> I know, I know. I know. <laughs> yeah. Figure it is. We got tons of money now. Yeah. yeah short ribbon. Lululemon, let's go. Get in the trucks yet. They're worth $160 billion. More than like four MGM combined. And it's got like. Uh, so stupid. Like what? Dozen trucks? <laughs> Yeah, why is Crocs still a thing? I I know many adults that still wear Crocs and they have little charms on them. I'm like, you are never getting me there. Like, fuck off. Like, well, I've seen well, you don't they have make like other house kinds of shoes. I no, guess. I have house. They don't make just the ugly ones. I do slides, man. I'm I, I'm a deer slides. slides yeah, yeah. I have like outdoor slides, indoor slides. I have multiple slides, but Crocs. No, that's like a a fucking like. You've somebody like captured your feet. It's like penitentiary. Like, 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 you know, like when somebody like captures or like, like, uh, kidnaps like a child and they put him like in a cage and stuff like that. And like, whatever they do, that's what they do to your feet. Like, Crocs are just sweaty <laughs> rubber crap that you put on your feet and you add charms to it. Like, it's just like the worst idea ever. Charms. Let's oh just, let's, like, what's the. Open up. Let's, like, let's. Te- it's the teachy. Te- I bet you we will find out, like, the owner of Crocs is the same owner of a tea tree business and they just sell tea tree on Amazon. Like, oh, you got foot fungus, huh? Well, why don't you get the croc juice? You know, like. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> create a problem and then sell the yeah, solution. Yeah, exactly. Create a problem, sell the solution. Fucking, that's just d- disgusting. And I'm, I, I used to wear, like, uh, don't get me wrong. I used to wear sandals. I used to be a hippie. Always had, like, the Birkenstocks and all that shit. Wore Birkenstocks with, with socks, <laughs> even healthier. I'm one of those guys. Don't do it anymore. But that's way better than fucking Crocs. That's just, ugh, that's gross. 
It's like a Crocs is like somebody got out of prison and was like, you know what I miss? Are the shoes that we had to wear in prison. Right. Yeah, yeah. maybe it's prison, prison shoes. Let's just make yeah. some of those. Prison shoes. Yeah, that's what they give you when you go into like county. You know, you yep. Crocs and shit. And I don't mind like a Crocs for the house. Like, like, oh yeah, these are my Crocs when I just want to throw something on and get the mail. You know, like that's fine. But like, I know multiple people, even comedians, they wear Crocs every single day. That's their go-to shoe. They're proud, loud and proud. They got fucking charms on it. It looks like shit. You know their feet are just moldy and uh, disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> Gross shit. Like, like Kay knows one of the people I'm talking about, actually. Okay, you know uh, Dean. I think his name's Dean Stanford. Dean Stanfield. Field. Uh, he has like the, you know, like yeah, the, the he's Theo Von hair. Yeah. yeah. Look at his Crocs. He had at Skankfest. He had red, white, and blue Crocs. And I looked at them, yeah. and I had so many yeah. things to ask him. <laughs> but then when it came down to it, I was like, you know what? I'm not even gonna talk to him about it. I don't even care. You know what's funny? Fuck the that. second me and Mumford got to got to Skank Fest, Dean found us and said, "Hey, can you help us move these tables real quick?" So it was like we we just got there and started working. Yeah. Should so, I hey, have done that? Hey, can you help that. us move these tables you inside have done to the that. warehouse? No, should I have done that? I don't know. That's the We've whole seen, thing. I've seen that guy do that Texas line dancing stuff with attractive women. And at uh, Latchkey on Tuesday nights in Crocs. Yep. It's quite Im- it's quite impressive, honestly. Yeah, but there's a I few guys just like drive. him. There's a few guys just like him that I know <laughs> on a, a Will- everyday a ba- Crocs guy. Who? Huh? William. Mm, no, William's a New Balance guy, but he wears Crocs. But I'm talking about people that wear Crocs every day, like. Oh God, you're like a homeless oh, yeah. person. And, you know, like you need to chill. <laughs> homeless Karens, like homeless stepdads of Karens. I like I don't even know what they would be considered. Like uh, some of them dated a Karen, and uh, yeah, I don't know who does that. Ugh, gross, gross. What? Hey, yeah. buddy. Hey, how's that? What just happened? Uh, all right. So this hey, place. Flux left. Oh, okay. You know he left a long time ago. Like that dude in his ass. Uh, let's uh go to Merry Christmas, fellow brushes. <laughs> oh yeah. Let's take a heartburn pill. Mm. Damn! What are you? Noise. Having heartburn if you don't drink. I don't get it. All right. I look at my beautiful face. Got a camera in it. Oh no. Ugh. Not ready for this. Moon man, moon oh, man, hey. can't you see? Um. Yeah. Yeah. Wait. <laughs> what the hell? Go down. You're a mean one, Mister Mr. Grinch. You really are. All right, I'm gonna go on my phone and you check my dog's collar GPS. Video? To make sure my girlfriend's not murdered. Hold on. Did you get a um a fi yeah, collar? Too. Yep. Me too. Yeah, they're, they're great. The best. They're great. My head. Very big though. Small dogs have problems with them, but Wiki doesn't mind it too much. Yeah, we sewed it Are so that it's snow? a little bit better. Oh my god. Right. <laughs> yeah, snow snow pearls. <laughs> snow metal balls. Yeah, if you don't know what we're talking about, there. if you guys have a dog, like, the reason why I got this is our, my dog, Wiki, 
in Burbank used to always just run out the door or sneak out the door. And next thing you know, he's just taking a walk. He just wants to, she wants to walk around the neighborhood. But scary as fuck when you don't have your indoor dog like, and she just runs away. Mm -hmm. uh, so this is a little collar that has like GPS and cell service on it. And the battery lasts about a month on a charge, but it tells you when it's getting low, mm -hmm. you throw it on the charger and stuff like that. And, uh, and it tells you when they leave. Yeah, it tells you when they leave your house, when they're in your house, where they are right now. Like right now, I'm going to find out where Wiki is. Oh, shit. And uh, my girlfriend left a while ago. So I'm kind of like actually concerned. Um, Your dog murdered her. Oh no! Oh my god! They're in Mexico. How are they in Mexico now? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, no. They oh, walked so far. They were in a shipping container <laughs> well, right now to, to the Philippines, short, short walk heading the to the Ukraine. <laughs> yeah. Oh no! <laughs> uh, wait. I'll get a, what? I'll get a, I'll get a, I'll get a, yeah, yeah. Let's do Panama. I'll get a side job ever... working uh, security in your neighborhood. <laughs> do you ever check well, the rain? Down three sounds lit. <laughs> oh yeah, we were up to like thirty-four <laughs> in Los Angeles, but we didn't try hard. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> only two made the cut. It was the Squid Game. You don't see shit two games. Yeah. Only two survived. <laughs> it it estimates their last steps, online five so days ago. Oh, the battery's dead. Oh, you better, you better charge it. <laughs> yeah, that's oh, the no. that's the worst part. Like the like if you don't like if you just like oh okay yeah my dog's collar is low and you just swipe it to the left or whatever. You have to like be on top of it. Like that's one thing. Right now, when it matters, oh yeah, I did. Uh, you know, I didn't charge that dog collar. So luckily, um, I gave my girlfriend new shoes and I put Apple trackers inside of them. So uh, Apple tag oh. trackers in them. So I can look at those. Oh. Hold on. Let's look at those. I don't know how to throw <sighs> Going through Apple, find my girlfriend. Uh, yeah. He's, he's kind of heavy too. What I do is I, if you hold Oh, God. Like She's been gaining weight with all the gummy bears. bears. I think she crushed that apple well, tag. Like, so. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Yeah, she yeah. crushed it. It was only good for so like 150 shit. pounds weight, and I think she went up there with a All right, so I got two. Fat so are you? So what do you do with the, the one in the front? Just, just pull that back against the one in your other hand. Kind just of like kidding. Glide and not let go of the one in the front. Yo. What are you guys doing with your balls oh, over whoa. here? <laughs> oh, or you know, we're just you know bouncing, <laughs> bouncing testicles yeah, around, just bouncing yeah. around, just showing them. <laughs> that was bouncing testes. Here. We <laughs> learn how to trod them. <laughs> Kim, what are you doing for things? I got a big hat. It's funny. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's hilarious, dude. That's yeah. so good. You're gonna be with family? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah, my family here. <laughs> oh my god. What about you? How do I do this? What, what are we doing? Uh, I'm trying to figure out stuff. Maybe, uh, which one of the balls? Like, uh, using them or some other oh, people. I got it. Here oh, yeah. Go. Uh, you put the pressure. Get it out of here. You just put these balls together and. <laughs> Put Where's blueberry yeah. buttons at a time like this? <laughs> blueberry, get this guy out of here. You can like hit it like this too. <laughs> I think that's a uh, uh, pretty good there. Always a good technique. Like Wait, here, Gotta here. spin those hey, things John. just right. Ready, oh my god, this Thrill. makes me okay. laugh so hard. Oh, twirling. Yep. Oh, I'm behind you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, 
my god, why is this so funny? I don't Santa's understand. bringing balls this year. <laughs> oh, shit, my ball. Well, oh, um, silver balls. Oh, silver balls. Silver <laughs> balls <laughs> make you <laughs> goo. I, I haven't been able to throw the ball. Silver <laughs> balls. <laughs> Ding alarm. <laughs> On merchant. <laughs> Soon it will be coming day. Hey, why are you a robot right now, Incom? You're not Blueberry Buttons anymore. Yeah, you're a robot. Robot balls. Robot balls. Robot balls. Smells like yeah. tolls. Oh, wait, who are you now? Wait, what the That's fuck? Wow. Oh, no. <laughs> he, <laughs> you were just like Skippy oh, the Door Boy or something. I don't even know what that yeah. was. Yeah, that was <laughs> yeah he, you were like Gilligan's Island, bitch. I don't know what the fuck that was. <laughs> Yeah, you're still a robot yeah. in com. What? Wait, did I block oh, you as a robot? Oh. I don't no, think. No, 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 no he's a robot. Damn, Jeez. Avatar thing. Oh, you play oh, play thing. Man, that's very unfortunate. Yeah, I think you clicked on. Oh, now you're J John F. Kennedy. Now you're British John. <laughs> British John, John, John Bryant. British Whatever. John. Every time he was walking around, I hear this yeah. whistle like Kurt Cobain. <laughs> are you tired or are you just injecting sperm out of your mouth? Looking for pineapples. I know <laughs> to wipe off from all this thing. Oh, Genesis is not back. <laughs> I need. I wish I had some kind of tracking device. Where is she? <laughs> she was walking the dogs a long time ago. Uh -oh. At least she didn't blow away. Uh, this might be a court later. Hey, I don't know what's going on. I'm here. I know, man. Timestamp 1:35 a.m. I love Christmas. CST. I love <laughs> Christmas songs. Chris, Christmas is like the most depressing time of year for me, but I love it. I love it. I love Christmas. I hate Christmas. Jingle bells. I hate all holidays. I hate all holidays. I like Hall Halloween. That's about it. Halloween's a good one. Oh yeah, Christmas sucks. I just like the songs. Ugh, I hate all I the like songs. New Year's is usually okay, Ugh. but that's not a holiday. That's just an, a bar holiday. But like shit, like <laughs> Thanksgiving, I hate. Like I don't really like turkey. I don't like, really care. Uh, Easter, I don't give a fuck. You know, uh, Secretary's Day is okay. You know. Secretary. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, so any, any Christmas plans? Christmas plans? No, honestly. Nothing. Me and Janice don't even buy presents for each other anymore because if we both wanted something, we'd tell each other, like, I want that, and I would just buy it for her or she would buy it for me, whatever. You know, like, it doesn't, it doesn't matter. <laughs> yeah. Like, like the get, like the whole Christmas thing, that's 100% for kids. And I get when you can't grow up anymore and you're like, I want to celebrate it, you know, oh, wow. well then have kids. Like that's uh, a way to <laughs> do that. <laughs> I don't give a I got, fuck. <laughs> I, I, got a, I got a, I got a cool Christmas present for you, dude. <laughs> I don't want a Christmas present. No, don't buy me any presents. Oh, I come any... on. Man. I don't want any cool. presents. I don't, I don't give a fuck. Okay. I don't even give presents to anybody. Like if you want a present and I like you on Christmas Eve, tell me. All right. Maybe Santa will come, <laughs> I, but but like like that's gay. Like I don't want, I don't give a shit. Oh, <laughs> shit. <laughs> oh yeah, we well, should just sit on Santa Band's lap and tell him what you yeah, want. Yeah, tell me Christmas. what you want, you little bitch. I mean, like, <laughs> <laughs> fuck you and your Christmas. Like I hate Christmas. You know, like like literally, my mom <laughs> buying me a Nintendo one year was like, oh, I get Christmas. But that's just because I was so young, I couldn't have a job and buy something for me. You know, like if I want something, I will sp sp 
like put money aside, work harder, like have a multiple job. I'll get that, you know, like the whole idea of Christmas is for kids. And I, I think it's weird when adults like really spaz out about Christmas. I'm like, what is, what the fuck happened to you? Like what, what is wrong with you, dude? Like, is it just that you are just like such a shitty worker or you just have no fucking savings ability that like you really look forward to Christmas because you want something or you just like magical shit? Like, are you just like, I just like Santa Claus and sparkly lights. Like, get out of here. It's like somebody be, uh, being obsessed about like yeah, some being uh, obsessed about the Easter Bunny. Like, wow, you you wear Easter Bunny shirts every day. Like, get out of here. Like, get out of here. I don't get it. Oh. Sorry for anyone that's really in Jesus and thinks that that's the day he was born <laughs> or whatever. Like, like that's when Mary did, did drops some born? eggs. I don't even know what what <laughs> it means to you. I'm talking about Jesus shit. Jesus is the reason for the season. Yeah. <laughs> his, his birthday is actually in January. <laughs> they, they got that part wrong. Yeah. Jesus <sighs> is the reason for the season. I just like Carolyn. This is my year. I, uh, I just love listening <laughs> to Carolyn music. Uh. Oh, man. Don't you just love riding around looking at the Christmas lights? <laughs> yeah. Singing I mean, Christmas there's like songs. a part of hippie of me that likes looking at lights and singing dumb songs but i hate i i i hate the i hate the religious part of it and that's so baked into it that it really upsets me i'm just like nah i like um, oh yeah i like making cookies and making gingerbread houses you could do that all day holiday treats are fucking awesome yeah, but I like holiday to do it. Holiday treats? That's what I'm saying. Like, oh, yeah. if you want a holiday Ginger treat, Christmas you can buy it treats, right now. Yeah, you can buy it right now. Ball, you can buy oh, that right well, yeah, now. No, little that's cookies. just what I like to do. It doesn't matter if it's on quote, on Christmas. Oh, man. Uh, it's cooler when it's on Christmas. Fudgies. Fudgies? Wait, wait, wait. What the fuck is a fudgy? What the fudge is I don't this? know. We just called them fudgies, but they're fudge. <laughs> what are I don't know. fudgies? They used to call them fudgies. <laughs> Guys, you want to get some fudgies? fudgies? Me and my friends always used to call them fudgies. <laughs> they call them fudgies for Christmas sometimes. <laughs> Little fudgies. Let's like get some that. fudgies. I don't know. I like all that. Let's get some fudgy, Christmas boys. <laughs> hey, after well, we get off our mopeds, let's get us some man. fudgies. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, man, let's good. cruise in our mopeds and get Kids some fudgies. Fudgy. That'd be awesome. Oh, here, there's some fudgies over there. <laughs> they do Park this. this. Um, thing where there's like a gingerbread house contest, and it's like make the best one, oh, and people go all. This. That's horrible. All out. Oh, that's cool. It's kind of cool it. though if you make it real Fuck nice. Off. Kids <laughs> love that stuff. Yeah, kids like that. Like you could tell when Kim was molested. Like obviously during the house <laughs> making years of her life when it was like, oh, you want to make a house using gingerbread? Like definitely not like an eighth year old or a nine year old. She got molested when she was four. <laughs> like she's <laughs> logs to make the gingerbread house, Kim. By the way, anytime a girl is molested when she was four, that's when they have lippy pussy, oh, I heard. Oh, oh. <laughs> like, I heard it, like, really damages the cells at an early age, and that's why you have a lippier pussy. So the lippier the pussy, the more they got molested, the younger they got molested, I heard. Oh you know, I was going to... I heard that's real. I was going to say something. Mm. Oh, sorry. Mm. I, no, I was going to no, say no, something about I was, uh, Christmas. Just, uh, mm. Jesus. The, the uh, visual of that. Sorry. <laughs> no, go ahead. <laughs> no, no, no. Say, like, I never had Christmas. Jesus, that's illegal. <laughs> what, what? what the fuck is happening? <laughs> Bluebear, what do you want to say? <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> I just, I was thinking about lip. Pussies, and that just seems kind of. Mm. 
But uh, oh. anyway, I'm sorry. Let's continue our Christmas uh, <laughs> stories. <laughs> I love these people. Oh my god, I gotta get more eyes. Oh my god, wait! My girlfriend's not back! Wait, how do I track her? Still Maybe she back? went to go get ice. Why don't you call, call her? her. Call her she doesn't bring her phone! When she goes on rides, she... <laughs> we mean like, like, stand outside and yell. Oh, that's right, actually. Yeah. Janet! Just... Oh! Ring, ring a Wake bell. The neighborhood. I usually <laughs> just track my dog when she's on dog walks. But she never charges the battery. Uh, um, yeah, go outside and call the, the dog. The tracker's not on. Oh, God, she doesn't have her phone. Uh, oh, I bought her those hair clips. Those hair clips are trackers. All right, let me try to like track. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, I got those. Maybe she's got a uh, tracker Crocs. By the way, if you don't know, get these like hair scrunchies for your girl. They have trackers in them. Um. <laughs> Well, she got the vaccine, That's right? a great She's idea, that. honestly. Check Somebody should get later. those. Income. All right, Andy. I'm calling her hair trackers. Oh, no, she doesn't have it. Hello? Where are you? I'm in the bathroom, blow drying wiki. Oh, you're in the bathroom? Blo <laughs> giving a blow job to wiki? <laughs> yeah. Why are you giving a blow job to wiki? You just mind your own business. All right. Uh, she's been in the house the whole time, guys. I had no idea. <laughs> she was give, she was washing one of our dogs. She's giving a blow job to it. I mean, a blow dry to it right now. Uh, uncomfortable. That's kind. <laughs> yeah, right. That dog's gonna like that. I had no idea she was here. I literally thought. Wait, how the fuck? Like, how is she here? Like, all right, she's in the house. She's <laughs> washing the dogs you right can't now. Can you hear the blow dryer? <laughs> no. Wait, what the fuck? It's a big house. You have good insulation. It's just the other side of the house she's in. All right, let's go somewhere else, huh? One of the five bathrooms. Four. Uh, let's go somewhere else. Gum let's go to Gumball Lounge. Will there be Santa there? Hmm? Welcome to my anus. What's going on here? <laughs> Oh, so dark and colorful. Well, it's in the mirror. All right. What's the sound here? What? Interesting. Whoa. Oh, shit. Just went up an elevator. Wow, that was awesome. Yeah, that was quite a spiral. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. This place is pretty fucking badass. Yeah. This reminds me of Blueberry Buttons' house. Wait. Yeah, look at my house. You like the here? Wee! Rainbows. I'm a gumbo. I'm a gumball right. How do I get up there? How'd you get up there? Oh, jump. Just jump. Just jump. jump. Oh, man. Just jump. I know, I can't Just jump. press the jump button. I can't jump. Jump around. Just jump. Yeah, I'll catch you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. It's... I'm the same, dude. Brian, I'm <laughs> like trying to... I jump, but I don't go up. Oh, there oh, we go. Oh, the uh, pillow fight. Mm. Through the rain rainbow the hole, stars. Mark. Oh. Go through the rainbow hole. Hey. I got your pillow. I was going to put the pillow down here. There you go, you here. made it. Here, get it. Oh, it doesn't go down there. Oh, I like the... 
How it floats. Look, Bobo. Hold on! Randy. Mm-hmm. What, like... Dude, I was trying to talk to you like two yeah. times in the other world. Oh, I, I thought you were tell telling you me about... to be quiet. No, I said, Randy, hey, I'm trying to tell you about why I like Christmas. Oh, look at this. Oh. Look at the way you can sit like this. Yeah. Come on. <laughs> That's a, it's a hey, this, this looks like yeah. a cat to me on Nas Cherry Wine, dude. Yeah, That's you gotta the point at the, at the arm, arm, arm rest. Arm rest. Okay. Yeah. Oh yeah. Look at that. Whoa! I can see you. Look at Bob's dick. Hey, just Ow. gave the dog a bath. Hi, Toe. Hi. Hey, I got some. I got some Legos for you. I'm gonna give Brian Whoa. on uh, oh, Thursday. Oh, <laughs> The um. The yeah, I, I just armor, picked some up. At, I was like H E B, and I was like, oh, it it's some Harry Potter though. stuff. Oh, nice. <laughs> so, I don't know if you have Harry Potter. I don't. I just. But, I literally yeah. just got started. The only, the only Lego I have is the one you gave, and. And then like Brian got a bunch of like big pieces, right? Like big. Yeah, stuff. the shoe, <laughs> the Adidas shoe. The shoe. Yeah, and yeah. And then this the is... Bird of Paradise. This is a And then oh, yeah. the Chris one that okay. I already did, the bonsai plant. The bonsai I want the Bird of Paradise one so bad. Woo! Oh, shit. Yeah, I guess I'll get. Are you going to go Thursday, Janice? Or... I don't know. Yeah, I'm having the same right, Yeah. I'll just give it to him. I'll, I'll try to maybe meet him in the parking lot, but I might. We, we usually get there oh. different times. So. Well. Well, you guys always oh, like me I... at after, the right? spot. Oh, meet me at the you? spot. <laughs> Dude, all I have stuck in my head these days are TikTok songs. Yeah, me too. TikTok I actually songs. downloaded some of the full versions me of too. them. Me too. I like, I actually I like, some like the whole song. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's actually they're they're better than like the top forty or whatever. That are yeah. usually. Yeah. Cause I'm an island boy. No, stop <laughs> Just saying that. I fucking hate that song. <laughs> you know you I love it, it, Kim. You're an no, island girl. No, I hate it. I'm an can't island stand girl. Her. <laughs> I can't stand that song. <laughs> it's awful, man. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh shit, man. Maybe. I had to rejoin. Look, it's a kitty. <laughs> What took? Oh, what? How come oh. you had to give? How come you had to blow dry wiki? I just gave her a bath. Sorry about that, Mark. Oh. I'll pull off the side. Oh hey, where, where are you? Who's Mr. Oh. Magoo? Oh there you are. Hello. I fell off the side uh, oh, as well. Oh wait, he could Neither of us could get back up. <laughs> no, no, I like. I was saying. I was trying to tell you in the other world. Uh, what? Oh gosh. Oh there you go. Um. <sighs> That you know, I never had Christmas. You know, growing up, I had it maybe once. <laughs> Is that a before. banana? You know, other people. It's um, and yeah, it's a family. wall, banana you know, wall. The time I didn't. Yeah. So now it's like I really love like how people in a different families. Like maybe I'm with somebody for a long time, and their family does something wonderful, and I, I love to like see all the decorations and you know, be a part of it. It's it's really cool. Cause I never had we do that, a white, you know. we do a we do a white elephant yeah, on our Christmas time. Oh yeah, white elephant. Oh it gets, God, white elephant. It gets awesome. super competitive. What is that again? Oh, yeah? bring, like <laughs> some. We do a white elephant for Christmas, What's and white it elephant? gets super com. It's like you like, buy gifts. Fine, you gotta totally do it. Everyone buys a gift within That's a so certain cool. budget, so cool. and then you put like a num numbers in a hat, and everyone draws a number, and you pick it out and then you mm -hmm. um have like three tries to three tries to steal a present if you want it mm -hmm. and everyone open everyone opens up a present in the number order but if you want mm -hmm. like say you opened up like a speaker and i wanted it i could take that present <laughs> and like you you have to open up another one and it could be like it's something stupid that's fine. Yeah. Yeah. It gets no, super... You can do it for Christmas. Yeah. You can do it other times. Yeah. yeah it gets like, super yeah. competitive in my family. And, like, one time my sister, like, licked the present because she didn't want anyone to have it. <laughs> and then another, like, a family friend, he just, like, put it down his pants. And everyone was like, no, <laughs> we don't want that. 
Yeah. Then yeah, funny. you just straight walk out, be like, uh, "Bye guys, I'm sick. I don't feel good. <laughs> I got yeah. a big speaker. Let me go." <laughs> and that would be uh, take the pressure off of buying like, you know, like really super nice biscuit. Is that just what your family does? Or even you personal get getting? No, we do, we do regular. We do get regular gifts. Having to shop for personal fun. gifts is stressful too. Yeah. Yeah. It's so stressful. What is that? Oh, you're like, yeah, are they gonna terrible. like it? Is yeah. This, like... I don't like doing that. Gift this cards, is, like, cards. yeah. Well, this is vibe with them, I, you know. That's always. I try to, um, I try to just make gifts for people, and then it's just easier because then they're like not expecting, anything. and they have to like well, it. it's up <laughs> if you just nice. give people. Yeah, you have to you like just it. give people money. Like it's like that means nothing. Like you want to like put effort into it. I don't mind money. It, it can go south. <laughs> I like, yeah, but like let's I say like, like okay, hey, Jenna gives a thousand bucks and like I give you a thousand dollars. You're like, well, Mark doesn't know Hell anything yeah. about me, so he's just no. I'd, I'd read no. You know that I love <laughs> money, fine. so take it. <laughs> <laughs> That's yeah. a very generous gift in our I, family. Also, yeah. I also like would it, socks. Would that be? I like yeah. socks. I get like a thousand bucks. That's good. Socks are awesome. Want, I ask for socks. You want a thousand dollars for Christmas, Kim? Yeah. Socks every year. I want a thousand yeah, bucks like for socks. Christmas. Sure. All right, I'll, I'll send you. Yeah, hey Mark, for me, it's me, your cousin. Oh hey, <laughs> uh, uh, Kevin's over here. <laughs> What's up, Kevin? <laughs> There's a lot of cousins now. Yeah, I, know, I got yeah, a bunch a of cousins. In a, in a, I feel like Eminem now. <laughs> yeah. Jesus Christ. Yeah. yeah, that would be pretty nice. I don't like a thousand. Yeah. Like, I feel like appropriate. Like, when you have grandmas give you like a hundred bucks, you're like, what the fuck was this? What? Like a hundred <laughs> bucks? Wait, this is normal for you, Mark? What? Is getting a thousand dollars? What are you talking about? No, no, no. I'm <laughs> saying that I was, yeah. you know, when you know that somebody has like a hundred million dollars and they're giving you like fifty dollars. No, for, even like, fifty dollars would be. My grandma doesn't have My sister's giving me almond rope. One time, one time, my. My aunt and I were having, like, we had a big fight, and she sent me expired coupons for Christmas. Mm. <laughs> so, Take these expired so, coupons. You know, 50, 100, What was the fight? Bucks, five bucks, I'm fine. Um, <coughs> back, back, back when I was younger, I was hanging with a not-so-good crowd, and I, like, tried to break into her house, and, and <laughs> but I didn't break into her house, I just tried to. Damn. <laughs> and she found out. <laughs> yeah, it was and, and she still made the yeah. effort to clip those coupons. I'll be right back, guys. Yeah, <laughs> and send them. And she Here wrote in the go, card, Kim. "Merry Christmas." Um, if you want your present, you have to come to my house. Aww. And then I never came to her house. Oh well, that's oh, actually kind of cute because yeah. then she's like, "Let's talk yeah. about what happened." Yeah, we're good now, though. I we did talk about it. Yeah. So. <laughs> But yeah, she sent expired coupons. <laughs> That's pretty funny. <laughs> yeah. One time, uh, a, a family friend, it was my sister's son, and she gave the, my, uh, anyway, as a gift, because she had a son, she gave my sister's son, my nephew, a bottle of Kaopectate for his birthday. What's that? It was like the weirdest fucking what gift is that? ever. <laughs> like, what the hell? It's like an anti-diarrhea uh, yeah. kind of medicine. Or oh. Like Did he have like diarrhea at her it. house or something? No, no. Her own son had problems, and she thought, oh, this would be a nice gift <laughs> for what your the heck? son. You know, just in case he had problems. She, she thinks that yeah, everyone's really son weird. has oh. diarrhea? <laughs> I don't know. Just a big bottle you know, of but those are. It's almost like when you do have it, like diarrhea, when it does happen, you're like, oh, wow, I have this, though. <laughs> yeah, so, yeah, you know, so I, I never, bad, but I never think to take medicine when I have diarrhea. I always just think, I'll just let it happen. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It usually clears in a couple of days, kind of thing. But yeah. Like, Why? Most of the time, unless you're in really bad shape. Yeah. Where's Yonder? Did he die? He probably did He's the still Irish in that Christmas uh, world. Goodbye. In that Christmas land. Or Do you want me to nose uh, it or something? <laughs> Do you want me to announce it? Okay.
Brian has uh, diarrhea. No. What? Brian has diarrhea? <laughs> diarrhea. Uh, diarrhea. Nice. <laughs> That's not. Some people think it's funny, but it's really hot and ready. <laughs> <laughs> the old kid song. Yeah, All those hot dogs. Diarrhea. Hot doggy oh, diarrhea. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> Only the best on virtual. Dude, record. I had this place out here. It's called uh, Torches. Uh, Janice, do you Thank know that place? You. What? Do you know that place, Torches? Did you just have Christmas? Yeah, Ryan just sent me his Christmas gift. <laughs> it's basically what I was wondering if I should announce or not. Uh, uh, it was through Venmo, which is very relevant to what we were just talking about, so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> 1,001. Oh, was it one? 1,001? Yeah. Couldn't see what that I get 1,000 more. Oh, he bested me, man. Oh, <laughs> oh, you want to raise the stakes, Mark? You want to... <laughs> Wait, I need 1,001 dollars. <laughs> Santa Brian. But, but I think, I think like kids are like way cooler. Like if, like if you know, if you know Santa. people, like, like Kim wants a surfboard. Kevin, I don't know what Kevin wants. I don't know what uh, Randy wants. I know that, that, that I don't I don't even know what Janice would want. Like, nothing. I want I, nothing. I know Legos are cool. Legos are cool. I want what world peace. Something <laughs> that they don't want, though, and you thought that they wanted it, and it's a shitty get. And then they're just like, God, it's Christmas. DMT. Yeah, you should just get everybody what they don't want. <laughs> yeah, Diarrhea medicine. That's what you should get everyone. Diarrhea medicine. <laughs> I, I don't, I don't want a thousand dollars, Mark. I, I don't want it. Okay. No thousand dollars. But no, I really Can want it. Us? But you know. Reverse psychology. Hello. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> Why, Sorry, what, I've been doing that a good lately. Christmas it's gift for my you. Go to voice. Huh? Hold on, I gotta get my coat. What, what Christmas gift would you like, or that you had over the years that you uh, liked? VR, because it's so hard oh, to get so in good. Australia without paying oh, inflated prices, and I don't want to do that. Oh shit! Mm -hmm. Yeah, I bet. Yeah, true. That's right. There's probably extra taxes. Don't feel and bad. Shit, huh? You're you're the early adopters who are like paying inflated prices to test the hardware. <laughs> In a couple of years, I'll look dog. smart right now as the community. Yeah, Boba's an early adopter. He's been in this thing for a long time, right? For a while. Yeah, I got the first, like, consumer headsets. I didn't get, like, the dev kits that were early. Uh, but I got the mm. first gen Oculus Rift in, in it was April 2016. Oh my god, wow. That was when I, when I got in. What was the, uh, so, but, yeah, Sorry, uh, Cam, I don't, oh, Cam wants no, go, go ahead. Uh, that was for my birthday. Yeah, well, no, I don't know what you want for Christmas, you gotta tell me, but, I don't know what Janice You didn't even get me anything for my birthday. You don't have to get me anything. <laughs> I know, dude, I was just moving. <laughs> I, was really I, I have a question joking, for everyone, joking, though. I'm joking. I have a question. I'm gonna go from person to person. What when you were nice. when you were in high school? What kind of kid were you like? Like the stereotypical like jock, nerd, skater, like class what, clown. Yeah, oh. class clown. Like what? What were Start you? From Starting from birth. Kim. Mm. Mm. I was like the athletic emo metal kid. What What was your sport? I played uh, water polo and swimming. Damn. Wow, Water I would baby. never have thought that. <laughs> Were you always athletic? Yeah, yeah, I would say. Uh, yeah, I used to do gymnastics when wow. I was young, and then I broke my arm and I couldn't do it, so they told me to do swimming. <laughs> and then I, yeah. Badass. Well, I broke my arm to where it, like, couldn't be repaired, so, like, it's still broken. But just, like, you. Oh. That's, that's a weird combo, athletic <laughs> stoner. Right? Mm -hmm. yeah. And stoner, yeah. I feel like they are—they uh, have a symbiotic relationship. 
Not really, so because exercise you produce weed makes you lazy. Endogenous cannabinoids. Sorry, go ahead. I would smoke like after swim practice, like uh, going home. That'd probably <laughs> be a chill high. Move on. <laughs> All right, leap us. You know, like runners high. That's the same as smoking weed. What do you say? Not what really. Kind of kid were you? What kind of kid were you in high school? Like, what, what <laughs> was your posse? What oh, were your I just friends say like? stupid ADHD shit and like piss everyone off. No, up. like, were you a nerd? Were you a jock? Were you a troll? Were you a skater? Oh, I was definitely a nerd. Like, nerd? What kind of nerd? I'd go to where people used to smoke cigarettes and we played soccer there. <laughs> I was a nerd. Okay. What about you, Mark Leota? That's cool, right? Um, I was like a fat nerd. You were, and I was like <laughs> Mark said, geek. I was like a fat nerd. <laughs> <laughs> but like, I hung out with all the cool kids because like, I like, you know, I was ha hanging out with like all the gangster people in my school and like, they had my back. So Is it because you were fat? Yeah, I was like fat. I had like weird hair. Like it was like down on my chin and like, like parted like, I was in Final Fantasy or some shit. What was your genre then? And, like, like were, you, all... were you like into anime? <laughs> were you like... Into emo music? Yeah, anime, like... anime, not emo, but like music, That was after your time. Yeah, I was like, yeah, I was like, you know, listening to like rap shit and okay. I don't know, whatever everybody else Like Jinko Jeans? Yeah, like nerd. Yeah, well, Jinko <laughs> Jeans was like when I was in sixth grade. Oh, okay. When I was in sixth grade, I had Jinko Jeans, I had a pierced earring <laughs> on my left ear. That was like, I was, uh, Oh, wow, in sixth like grade, that's a cool sixth grader. Yeah, ni 98, <laughs> man, it was like nuts. Okay. <laughs> Yeah. All right, what about I, you, Boba? I once got ran over by a uh, Kind of like <laughs> stoner, like our kid. I don't yeah. know. Like I, I, I went through a lot of different circles, but like I, I did like theater. I did jazz band. Did Whoa, theater! That's unexpected. But, what? Yeah. Boba's a theater uh, kid. I did improv. Wow. Uh, improv. I, I used to have like really long hair. Uh, wow. But yeah, now I'm like bald. I'll, I'll try and post some pictures from like my high school Ooh. days. Okay. In the Discord, Wait, you're but, bald now? Um, I. Eh. Yeah, pretty much. Bald like freaking yeah, reviews! Oh my god! <laughs> yeah, yeah, Holy yeah. shit! Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Uh, cool. Lots of testosterone. Of, like, my, it's my much to do was, about like, nothing. Am I right, like, Boba? High school king. He was like prom king and homecoming. What would we say? Um, ignore it. <laughs> he said much yeah, to do about yeah, nothing, right, Boba? Yeah, <laughs> uh, going like as a freshman, my brother was a senior, so like I, he and it was really cool. So like that helped me like socialize more. But like uh, yeah, I, I had a good group of friends. We, not like in like a specific group. But I wasn't like in the nerds. So, like I, I was friends with a lot of people, oh, but good. definitely like stoner. Yeah. Like, uh, like I feel like yonder kind of would be like the school meth head. Well, we'll never know because he's not here. <laughs> oh, he's not here. Oh, he left. What, well, what, what, uh, what, uh, click was your brother in? Um, yeah, that's a good question. He, he, he kind of transcended boundaries. He was, a, he was a class clown for sure, mm. but like he, he was able to kind of, uh, just generally like with everybody. Yeah, yeah. He was, cause he wasn't Wait, like, uh, like a jock or anything. He didn't play sports, Wait, you know, you but he, he did, he did comedy that? and yeah. he did like video production okay. too. Um, he didn't do like music stuff, video. but. He's, uh, yeah, uh, he's, he's, okay. no. he's cool. kind of his own, own beast, yeah. yeah. What about you, Ankom? I just chill in the chat, because I don't know. Uh, I was of a different era because I'm a little older, so uh, they would call me a new waver. So I was like into Duran Duran, Depeche oh. Mode. What is he? Did you and, grease your uh, hair back and wear a leather jacket? No, uh, I don't it wasn't think like that's a really greaser, greaser thing, but, but we just had you know, like floppy like, yeah. Duran Duran. Wait, like, what did Blueberry <laughs> say? Did you, know, you wear a members only jacket? Blueberry, Blueberry was a Duran Duran guy. Never wore New members wave. only Like jacket. an 80s guy. I thought an those 80s were guy, really yeah. weird. I don't know why. I, I, well, I pictured like Johnny uh, Depp. Buff Buffalo check. In like... Oh, oh well, that's nice of you. Yeah, a little longer. Yeah, definitely. People the thought I had Duran Duran hair. So. A lonely time yeah, but I also ran cross country and track, and that's where I met a lot of my friends. So that was that was a good thing too. So it was a little sporty, but I was also kind of nerdy. I hung out with some like really dweeby people, and we would hang out like way over in the corner of a field and like talk at lunch and and eat. 
Yeah, so, and those are the know, good people. I was kind of a loner, right? too, so it was like a weird combo. Yeah, yeah, some of my friends kept me going, definitely. Yeah. Did you wear those really short shorts when you ran track? Yeah. Definitely. I did. I had those little, like, red vinyl shorts where your balls could be, like, hanging out of them nice. when you're running. Yeah. 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 Way above yeah. your thigh. Yeah, way, way the hell out there. Like, 80s, yeah, shorts. My friend, one time, when he was running track, he thought he could run faster without underwear, and his his, his dick was flopping out, Does that and it, ever, like, caused a big skirmish. Does that ever hurt when your dick, flo or when your dick or balls flop too hard? Okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. If you're not wearing underwear, hell yeah. Oh, yeah. Shit was bad. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 It's uh, and you could have chafing if you get. Yeah. Last question. <laughs> Did you ever wear a crop top? <laughs> oh shit! You mean the little half shirt? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I did. Uh, but I yes. And come wear crop tops. Yeah. But, but that was more uh, elementary school. Elementary school. Oh, Bell bottoms goes further Wait, back than me. I'm not older, that old. Or, I mean, that's uh, a seven. Bell bottoms fucking suck, man. Yeah. I think. <laughs> you drag around and that's get a all different wet. era. Yeah, bell yeah, bottoms. That, that's like a whole so different so era. I used to wear bell bottoms. 80, I was in the 80s. Like yeah. definitely in the 80s. In the 80s? When, so you guys just barely 90s? <laughs> oh, 90s <laughs> bell bottoms. It wasn't bell bottoms in 90s. It no, was more bell like bottoms flares. came back in the 90s. No, 90s was flares, not bell bottoms. No, no, they had bell bottoms. If you're a hippie, you could buy bell bottoms. Yeah. And I used to wear bell bottoms. But you didn't wear a members only jacket? I always thought those were fucking just too nerdy. I'm sorry. I didn't like the Tony jackets. I Although out of nostalgia, I might, I might buy one today. Yeah, out of weird, because I'll wear checkered bands now, just for the hell of it. And I didn't wear those in high school. That's a weird thing. Yeah. Well, I saw some of them are worth pretty a good amount of money now. So it's like, oh, because they're co collectible. Yeah. Very, uh, yeah, I don't now. think they make them anymore. Garment. I'm not sure. No. I'm but I, I would so definitely really pick one up if I saw it at the um, thrift store. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah Did you wear a vest? Like, the head of like Marty McFly? I wore a lot of vests for a while. <laughs> uh, not that kind of vest, <laughs> but uh, for a while we did vintage, so we would go to thrift stores and get like dress dress shirt vest mm. but that was a little later and just wear a t-shirt underneath that was kind of oh weird. yeah that's kind of that's more like a what would like that be like early 2000s pretty in pink yeah actually that was like a thrift store vintage okay yeah. moving on to mr pretty Magoo. pink what were you like in high school like what was your genre they're not saying that in america oh man like uh definitely definitely a stoner type and uh did the whole like av production thing like i uh, did some podcasts in high school in av uh oh no like like what year did you graduate senior year is like mostly not in school um 2018. That's the only type of Whoa! Oh, really podcast cool. didn't exist when I was in high school. Yeah, because yeah, you were saying podcast, and I was like, what? Wow. Yeah, awesome. And let's say 98% of the country. That's what year did you graduate? What year were you born in? Wow. Uh, what was that? 2000, oh. baby, over here. We got a 2000, oh. baby. Oh. Awesome. You can teach us all yeah, about the news. Got your whole life ahead of you. Gen Y. Oh, wow. <laughs> Good luck. You better learn how to do taxes. Oh, shit. Turbo tax. Oh. Turbo tax is fine if you're broke. Hey, <laughs> man. Yeah, if you're broken. Yeah, if you're not making any money, turbo tax. Yeah. Let's talk about higher people that are having these antibodies now. Yeah, no. Or if you're fraud, you know. Yeah, that's all. Just like. Mostly not in class. What were you, Janice, yeah, like in, in, in high school? Like what what, what person were you? Mm -hmm. <laughs> what person was I? What were you, Janice? The, the, the yeah. Turn this you need two vaccinations do do to have this? a complete, yeah. like, antibody Focus? resistance. Mm -hmm. to build You're not doing it. Hey, shut up! And the other one... What is You're not doing it. Yeah, fall off the side if you get a stop. Turn the camera backwards. What are you doing? I will come and do you in the butt. Oh. Um, the kind of person I was, uh, I was very lame Randy, in high school. You I know it. I was very into like nerd. No fashion, and like promises, promises. Me too. I, I just like dressing up and 
Like fashion, like you wore like dresses. Like drifting a lot, and like my friend was very <laughs> oh, into, into vlogging yeah. about it, and I and we kind of had like a little project going on with that. But other than that, I did not give a shit about school. I was not a stoner. I did not do anything athletic. I didn't. I didn't join any clubs. Um. I guess I was more artistic. Maybe autistic. <laughs> Artistic. Oh. <laughs> Artistic. Did you, you didn't join the art club? Very we didn't have an art club. I went to a school that was very science and math focused. And oh. so. Asian school. Yeah, basically. <laughs> I think there were literally like not more than 10 white kids in the school when I was attending. Oh. And maybe like oh, wow. same goes How for black survive? kids. It was like all um, yeah. in LA. Oh, no, it was wow. just a reverse when I went uh, to high Orange school. County. Well, yeah, technically it's LA County, but the feel is very Orange County. Was it southern, like like southern, like towards Orange County? Yeah, it's like right on the Actually, border. I know someone lives in Orange County and they okay. are Asian. Yeah. It's it, it was in Cerritos. They live in Orange or something. And it was at like a preparatory school so the whole yeah, shtick well, was getting everyone to go to college and one of their boasting points was like that like oh there's never been a single stuff. person who didn't go to college in the past like 30 years or something like that wow an Asian, not a gen school. Yeah. <laughs> do you have brothers and sisters i have one younger sister oh okay yeah she's like one and a half years younger than me Are you more successful? I was nerd, and then I lost a lot We're of weight. We're both very unsuccessful. Hey, Janice, <laughs> what I was nerd <laughs> up to uh, <laughs> sophomore in high school, and then uh, I lost a lot of weight, and then I was like one of those guys that was like all the popular girls' best friend, mm -hmm. and I was just like best friend guy. And I friend just zone guy? I just, hung out, I just zone hung out with all the hottest most popular girls but i was i was their best friend did they think you were gay no uh <laughs> that's why he was invited to the and, uh i was I, like i was i dated like the like the hottest hottest girl below me like the junior when i was a senior and she's like the like you know and then i dated a girl from another high school like it it was weird. I went literally from being the biggest nerd in the world to junior year. Like, oh my God, this guy grew into his body so good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, you are very good looking, you know? Dude, I got a bunch of that Aww. shit. After I was 15 to like 22. A bunch of chicks are just hit me up out of nowhere. I'm like, what the fuck? I don't know you. I'm like, we went to high when school. Is it gonna like, to me? What? what the fuck, guys? <laughs> Lee Bus is like, like when is it gonna date, happen? To I me? didn't date anybody. I didn't date anybody in high school. And then like, you know, in college years, like all those girls would hit me up. Yeah. I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> what happened? Hormones. Yep. Hormones. Yeah. Plus, have you seen Mark's videos from when he, he was like in his early twenties? Good lord! Oh yeah, I like right around that time. Yeah, I, was, I mean, I don't know. That's like why I'm fat. still a handsome man. I got all fat, dude. I'm all fat. I'm trying to no. lose weight. I've you got pretty people I, I privileged. No, I'm, I'm like <laughs> yeah, I'm does. jogging. No, I'm person. jogging. Like today, I did like three miles. And jogging around. So, just, are your parents pretty, to... or are you like one of those people who like? Their parents are super ugly, and they had real pretty kids. Oh, I don't. Well, well, my mom, my mom was really beautiful um, when she was younger. Um, you know, she was somewhat of a model. She worked at ABC Records as a singer, and um, the biological father is a different de deal. Um, uh, but yeah, they both look good. 
when you're talking you know. to me your eyes are all rolled back into your yeah, head yeah yeah dude this is the avatar like <laughs> so i have to like i have to go <laughs> this really is why i keep doing this <laughs> all right all right kim 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 <laughs> look at me like the undertaker all right, all right. <laughs> so, tell, 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 tell me when it works what am I working it's, with right now? I'm reading your mind. You're having all right, a seizure. Right, oh, gross. <laughs> it's just whites. I can yeah, see inside it, of you. I mean, I don't know. It's like those dolls that <laughs> like you lay down. you're doing a storm. Oh, it's totally storm like from X-Men. Yeah, this is this <laughs> new avatar I did it. Yeah. It showed me like these weird... Yeah, it's like that doll. Oh, where you lay it down and it closes its eyes. Ready me. Hi, guys. <laughs> <laughs> I can see your brain. <laughs> you that? Brain. Oh, there's Boba. I mean, freaking reviews. <laughs> I wish I had that see-through blood. That'd be so cool. <laughs> wow, hey, hey leave your, us. Uh, ready player me? Uh, you have a very yeah. unique voice. Oh, that's cool. Oh yeah. Your... Is that an like. insult? Exactly... No, hey, it's, Janice, it's actually kind of re Janice. relaxing. What? This mm -hmm. is what Kevin looks like. Yeah, I know. Real. In real life. I know. Oh, that is one hell of a hipster beard. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. That's a good looking beard. Dude, I need, yeah. I want to grow Enjoy a beard like camp. this. I wish I could. I've got one of these This too. looks awesome. I have like an autoimmune, I have like uh, alopecia barbe, and it like comes and goes over the years. So I have like a spot on my like chin. You know, that like it grows, but it's just white hair. <laughs> and like it takes like, oh, it, I don't even know the the time in the middle it'll just yeah it's like on the side of my chin and it'll just I've go away it. randomly I've got it. that's yeah, why it, i went last time my i had it was that. 2012. it's very common in 2012 i had this brian had it for a while yeah in 2012 what? the bald yeah, spot in, in your beard I had it. oh yeah yeah it's stress like induced? stress or yeah, yeah, some kind that, of yeah. like uh it's easy yeah that happened like, like, like weird thing years ago. but red bum in the chat room just said a black guy who collects comic books wears glasses like, you, you're never going to meet a black guy that collects comic books that doesn't wear glasses. Wait, so what? Right? What are you talking about? Uh, oh, my God. Red Bum's genius. Wait, so you're saying Red Bum, that, that's his? That's who he was when he was a kid? No, no, no. Uh, yes, he did. <laughs> Maybe it he is. should be here. <laughs> I didn't even think black. about that. I actually but have met a lot of... I was saying a joke, but a black guy who collects comic <laughs> books always wears glasses. <laughs> Like, have you ever seen a black guy go, yeah, like Spider-Man? Like, no, he always has glasses. I've, I have met a, I have met a lot of black dudes who are very nerdy, though. Yeah. And black guy, like nerd black anime. guys are my favorite nerds. The ones that wear glasses? Like, oh, hell no, I like Sandman. <laughs> what are you talking about, the, Sandman? The, the, the I don't even know what that is. Uh, it's a Neil Gaiman comic. Yes, Mark? Uh, Damn, look at that. Oh, I was Big just saying that I haven't had this Boy. since 2012. What? Like, I had two oh. spots. I haven't had the the circles on my face since 2012. And mm. it just came up when I moved. And it just, like, you know, redid their whole, like, nastiness on my face. It and it just goes away. Related. There's nothing you can do. It's just stress-induced. You know? They say your beard looks like pubes. Yeah, yeah it's stress-induced. It doesn't it's look also, that bad. It's uh, also, get some tea tree oil. Sometimes <laughs> it's also a yeast infection. Dude, Hans Kim right told it's me. Thrush. He came up to me in the hallway you and he's like, out on your Hey, man, did you miss a spot? Yeah. And I'm like, what do you mean? Like, <laughs> my face? I don't uh, think it looks that bad. And he, he like, he touched oh, my we're going chin. Oh, we're going to the House of Bloof. Okay. Let's go. Red Bomb was in the chat last night or in the show last night and did <gasps> stand up comedy. What is this? It's a sunflower house. It's cute. Man, this is a cute ass house. I would I would like this house. Backyard with with all the sunflowers. Nice, uh, and outdoor patio thing, right? Blueberry it's buttons out there. You cool. want that? Swimming yeah. Pool. All it's missing is maybe a little grill, you know? Oh, yeah. It needs a needs barbecue a machine. Yeah. <laughs> what was that? Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's nice. I don't know if I like the furnishings. It's a good Airbnb, you know? Not know. too comfortable, but it comfortable enough. This is like enough. a house I was looking at in, in mm -hmm. shallow pool. It's true. It, it's nice. 
Where? Oh, in Texas or Nevada? No, in Vegas. Yeah. No, this is like oh, a couple Viva, a few years ago. Vegas. Yeah. A few well, years Vegas ago. has got its oh. own style, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah, they have these like weird, like, uh, like, um, thinner areas mm. like this, and you'll have like. I wish oh, I was good at interior the decoration. From the doorway, and you'll have another pool over here. And yeah, I've been watching have like these videos yeah, I mean, like, where um people have been like you know, making oh, yeah, wall panels and stuff and, and like on walls like they, instead of because mm -hmm. like they can't afford to buy it so they like make it. Yeah, I've seen those on TikTok too. And I wish I could do that. Yeah. Me too. Like doing like the walls on here. Monotone going on. Huh? Keep this yeah, close it's just pretty it's though. It, like the like when we moved into this house, just the the idea of, of like figuring out how to decorate was like overwhelming almost because like how do you yeah. even think of like yeah. oh this little trinket would look good here oh that color would match with that color and like it's not like you're getting everything in one place either it's like how do you manage all that in your head yeah. It's, it's almost so like much. you need like a fucking interior deck and you guys to be like, oh, this is what you need. You guys have like yeah. high walls, don't you? And yeah. Ceilings. Yeah. So it's like even what? more. We have high ceilings. Yeah. So it's, I, it's, it's a bad thing. <laughs> I wish it was. I love high ceilings. I don't think so. Like, I think yeah, it's like more quite, annoying it's than good. I like it. Get all the decor. Every couple of months, just do a different uh, design. Ugh, can't be bothered. <laughs> That's a lot of work. Right? Every month. That's cool. That's crazy. I don't even decorate oh, for Christmas. What are you talking about, Leapus? <laughs> yeah. Just move this table. Switch it out every month. Yeah. Designers Dude, don't you come want in. Just like an interior decorator to come through and be like, okay, you need this and that here, this and that there. Brian, are we at interior we decorator level? Though, right? I mean, what? <laughs> Oh, no. And they might come up so, with some really ugly shit. At one shit, point, right? my boyfriend yeah. wanted our place to look more like a hotel room. So we started <laughs> buying like hotel stuff. Like we have a lamp with plugs in it. And, you know, what the heck? Yeah, That's convenient. the aesthetic that, that he wanted to go for? Yeah, that's convenient. Yeah. Those are convenient. A hotel right? room? I was like, I, 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 I yeah. I that. <laughs> so we, we got like really nice comforters and pillows oh, with nice. like thousand counts and that, stuff. That's like, uh, that's like what oh, a yeah. six year old would say if you're like, try to make this room <laughs> yeah. really fancy. What do you want it to look like? They'd be like, oh, that one hotel we went to. <laughs> Yeah, the and he, like, I'm serious. We have this like the square like, uh, lamp with like plugs in it and a USB port. <laughs> oh, that's convenient. Yeah, yeah. Those are yeah. cool yeah, though. Convenient. Those are convenient. Yeah. Those USB port stuff, man. I love that shit. Yeah, it's nice, but weird theme going on. <laughs> Would you, Do you hate have the like most power plugs in your house that have like weird. USB built in? Uh, no. What? Because that's kind of yeah. a lot of places have that now too. Yeah. Where like the outlet actually has a USB, no. you know, plug in. We don't got that. No, what? Cool. And Com asks if we have those uh, outlets, those plugs that have USBs built into them. Yes. You can easily what? convert that. Yeah, though. not in every room, but yes. yeah. It's probably what room do we convert. have that in? Uh, most of the rooms. That's so all the what? Mains, yeah. what? Type of accessories. You we can... do? Yeah. It's not true. in our bedroom, right? <laughs> I'm stuck. Yeah. What? <laughs> we have that? You gotta look. <laughs> when was the last time you plugged something in? Uh, like every other day. <laughs> yeah, from like the bathroom outlets, plugging in like. Food or a hair dryer, oh, look, you can change. anything that's like Hitachi, a blow dryers, really stuff like that. Oh, it gets not rid a lot of, of USB. Yeah, it's a nice thing? convenience, so it's cool that you have that. Yeah, I didn't even know we had uh, it. Oh, and chairs. <laughs> uh, one thing on that I that Mr. lately Bruce I've been kind of like irked up. about is the yeah, type of lighting that we have. <laughs> like it's so cold, you know. It's that like white light. <laughs> Holy shit! You can't turn it down. You can't. Turn it up. Yeah. Yeah. 
Mm-hmm. Oh, do you, Where? do you have in the uh, kitchen in the living room? The pictures that you we have product? three different kinds of lights. Yeah, I don't like it. It's it? it's like that white light. You know the one in the hallway how it's like golden and warm. I like that. Right. That's there's LEDs yeah. can have different. You can actually yeah. buy different light bulbs yeah, that yeah, have I different know. lights, Stop. right? So when, once cool these run out, has yeah, blue in it. Yeah, we you switch either out have to yellow or white. I like white. I don't like white. Like I want light. Let's get shit right. done. I feel like but I'm in the lab. But if you want yellow, that's fine. I mean, it makes sense. Yeah. I like yellow. Light. Yellow light. Uh, yeah, I like yellow. Warm. I like warm yellow. Warm yellow. Well, that's yeah, my yeah. Crystal, that, crystal light lamp. You do need to balance it out. Like it's just one of one type is like too much. Cool, cool white is for daytime to resemble like daylight, and warm white is for night. You know, everyone has something to say about these lights. God damn it. <laughs> it's just facts. Because, like, you have RGB. And cool white is just RGB. And warm white is without the blue. Like, we have the um the hue lamp. And so you can change it from warm to... Oh. Yeah. Just anything. Oh, you can, you can awesome. change it wow. on your phone. I can have okay. colored. This we is... have those lights we already. Get that. We already have those lights. We did bought you, this house and they already have these light bulbs. Yeah. So we're no, not going to throw them away. We're going to wait for them to die. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's what I mean. When, when they die, we should get <laughs> Most those. Most of the light bulbs yeah. we have and in this house actually are the ones that can do yellow or white. Or they can do all different colors if we want them. We put it on a man. timer too, oh. so that like it turns on at five o'clock at night or whatever time Energy we want, saving. or it turns off. Yeah. Yep. Okay. And then, yeah. if I don't want the light on and I'm not home, I could turn it off like somewhere else. It could be like, like yeah, hey, no, the other day California. I was like covering, yeah. uh, no, like I was cool. reporting like on yeah. the anti-Jew rally that was in Austin. Red Bum yeah, was like leading it, with, uh, and Wi-Fi. I didn't want to be there, but like I was talking to yeah, Red Bum, and he's like, well, you know, I have those lights also. Worth well, it. I have, we haven't, we haven't had, yeah, it's worth it. We haven't had to change these light bulbs. You know, you have a, a problem with run on sentences. Year and a half. LEDs. Your faces are run on sentences. Yeah, the LEDs. LEDs. It's very long. Yeah. Uh, yeah, long face, and they bitch. Don't, the they don't use hardly any power, right? Too. So mm-hmm. whoever, yeah, so whoever created LEDs. Thousands of what? Yeah, worldwide probably. It's yeah, crazy. you should get these these Any... light bulbs, Janice, because yeah. we haven't had to change them for almost like two See, years, oh, year and a half. Yeah, once year. once the ones that we yeah. have die out, it's... lights running from like the yeah. yeah. I'm not trying to waste shit, any light bulbs. Yeah. They turn that off. But they they I like it. <laughs> right. Yeah. Plus, you can change colors and have. <laughs> yeah. Oh, the hue lights. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, oh, okay. you're right. This does seem like an Airbnb, huh? It's 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 just yeah. It's All not right, really it's home. I can live in a house nice. like this. Right oh yeah, I mean it's got a lot of nice space. Mm-hmm. I don't like the hanging stuff. It's a good stuff, entertaining but... house. I Only do. One bedroom though, right? I like the. <laughs> I like when a place has this many windows, like wall to almost ceiling. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, it's also I love the that. Like yeah. old school, very Swedish style, right? <laughs> yeah, you're right. It's like all the, the IKEA houses. The more windows, the better. I like this. Yeah, you got some privacy at least. I want a bigger yeah. home theater area, though. I feel like you got you got two sit down <laughs> chill spaces. You got two coffee yeah. tables. Yeah, yeah, this is like, this is yeah. weird right here. This, this is, like three collections. No these are like yeah, these are like theater chairs right here. This is like a waiting room right here. Yeah, somebody drew. Who the hell am I gonna entertain in this area? Right. Yeah, give me a one of my buddies yeah. just with them one chair. So he's standing there. Yeah, 50 people. <sighs> you could open the doors, I, I guess. You know what? Three person I went to a hotel show. room and they had three <laughs> TVs in it, and one of the TVs was in a mirror in, in the bathroom. Oh, I've and that's seen what, those. I was like, oh, that's what I want. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's cool. They had it at Caesar's Palace when we went. No. What I was. The one I went, I think it was Four Seasons. I saw that. The first time I ever saw like wind uh, mirror TVs was in that Skechers commercial I was in. I went to the bathroom and I was like, oh, I gotta go to the bathroom. It was like super. It was like 5 a.m. They were like cutting my hair and putting makeup on me, and I went in the bathroom and I'm like, Oh my God! They've got TVs in the mirrors. 
That's this is cool. so cool. <laughs> I've never even seen one actually. That sounds really cool. It's super neat, man. It's like I mean, yeah. so open the store, sit down, movie theater. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Dude, they've expanded I liked it because they. To, uh... Oh, okay. No, no, go ahead. Oh, uh, uh, I was in a, in a, a lift when I was in San Diego a couple months ago, uh, and like mm -hmm. there was a new Escalade, I think, or something, and they had in the rearview mirror, like the backup cam, what? would show through the rearview mirror. Oh, I've seen that. Yeah. I've seen that. Was... Yeah, yeah, I'd never seen that before. I was like, what the fuck? Oh, that's cool. That's no right. shit. That's cool. That's, that's cool. Yeah. No, Imagine breaking your this... rearview mirror. <laughs> With this house... Have you ever seen that? Like, if this was, like, more of a party house, if you had the doors that would, like, glass like this still, but, like, they would open up oh, I've seen that to the too. outside, yeah. you know what I mean? So you have the indoor-outdoor. Yeah, yeah. That's what glass. it feels like it would need. Glass. Yeah. That would be cool. I mean, I don't know how you would do that. I mean, you could do it, though, but yeah, it seems can. like that's what this place my, could use. My friend's rich aunt had a mansion, and she had that. Yeah, I, I always think that's neat especially yeah. in california you know mm -hmm. indoor outdoor entertaining which is what this would be perfect yeah. for hers opened up to i would like pool. that here oh yeah i mean you got a pool over there you're mm -hmm. barbecuing and all that yeah yeah that's cool. i get the fish I tank like now that. you can kind of see the tv through it maybe that's what it's for <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, fish tanks are cool, but they take some maintenance, man. It's just yeah. like a big one. It's kind of gross. gross too, right? If you don't maintain yeah. stink. Yeah. Right. yeah. Yeah. Okay. Or like it's salt water and all sure. that. It, yeah, it's a lot of work. Look, it's See, nicer, if I was, but... if I had a huge salt water tank, I would also be hiring a person to take care of it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, if I had, you had that the money, much money for it. You know? Yeah. Yeah, True. I Stop think the uh, saltwater it. fish are not that cheap either, probably, man. Oh, yeah, it's an no, expensive the, hobby. the tank it's itself fun. is... Mm -hmm. the yeah. re and you have to take stuff. care of the reef yeah. in it. It's crazy. Oh, yeah. Uh, My yeah. buddy's got an aquarium yeah. about this size, and it's... it's... It's impressive, Some but it's a lot of cactus in the stuff. <laughs> yeah, yeah, the maintenance. Expensive. Especially saltwater, getting, like, the... Probably the pH right, or the, the, the salt in there right. I, I don't know. But the saltwater fish are beautiful. I'll give it that. So I follow some YouTube school, channels uh, parasite. that uh, focus a lot on <laughs> yeah, fish tanks gross. and stuff. I remember when I was a kid, did you ever get that like oh, a yeah, fish tank I and then that. the fish yeah. ate the other fish? They get like cannibals if you're not careful. Oh, like when you, you put have, two like, beta two fish together? Mm -hmm. fish. Yeah. 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 That's yeah, cool. yeah. And they eat I each had, other. Uh, it's like horrific. Fighting fish. Yep. I had a um, 10 gallon tank and I put a crawdad in it and it would like eat my fish. <laughs> and then one time it it escaped, and I couldn't oh, find man. it, and I was just like, well, whatever, it's probably dead somewhere. And then mm -hmm. I was sitting at the edge of my bed, and like I put my feet, up, and it crawled onto my foot, and I thought someone was grabbing me, so I kicked it, and it <laughs> slammed into a wall. How oh. big was it? Oh man, it was, it was alive a good like size of it. my hand. Like, oh wow, that's big. It is big oh, size. Shit. Yeah. So I and that's like my worst fear: someone grabbing me from under my bed. So. <laughs> I just kicked <laughs> it <laughs> and uh, flew yeah, and died. Yeah, that'd be terrifying. <laughs> flew oh and God. smashed in the wall. Yeah. yeah that's hilarious. Next Halloween, the plan is. <laughs> you know, it's funny. I had something kind of similar. I had a couple of fish tanks. I had like a 15 gallon, 10 gallon, or whatever. And then these other people were getting rid of their fish. And they're like, can we just give your son these fish? So they put the fish in my big old tank. But one of them was really creepy. It was like a big algae eater, like the the bottom feeder. And, the and you could s I don't know. Yeah, it was a big old fish. long looking thing, yeah. and mm -hmm. and it would yeah. suck on the glass. Mm -hmm. And like at night, I could feel like the eye was looking at me or something when I was going to mm -hmm. sleep. And then like one morning, I woke up and the fish was gone. What? I mean, like just gone, what right? I'm like, what the hell? Yeah, it's like, like where'd it go it's or whatever. Hidey holes. I, I have no idea. Sorry. A year later, I opened up a bottom dresser drawer and there it was what? all dry and its eye all looking at me. What the it shit? somehow <laughs> gotten into my drawer. It jumped out of the was tank and went whoa. in the a drawer. What's he talking about? Huh? Was the drawer was underneath it? Or like 
Yeah, underneath uh, the tank. I had uh, I had like dresser drawers, my clothes, and I had the fish tanks on the dresser. Mm. Probably not the best place. Oh you know I mean? no, I it's had that. Yeah. It mummified. Uh, it wow. Was... <laughs> oh, it was disgusting. I didn't want to. Was think it about your it. underwear it was, drawer? Like... <laughs> no, no, it was oh. further down. Further down. Yeah, it was. I don't know what that drawer was. I didn't mm, get. I, I didn't open it up been... very often. You must have, have been used to, like, fish turtles? smell. <laughs> I know. Yeah, hey, they must have been disgusting for it to rot time. for, like, a year. Yeah. Just so it was disgusting. No, and it was big old... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I came all over the fish after I saw it. That's what happened. But, uh, anyway. Gross stuff. Have, yeah, have you guys shit. ever had good luck turtles? What was no, what what's we were that? talking no. about? Okay, it. let me just tell Brian real quick, because... Oh. Brian is a wondering what happened to Blueberry like Buttons, and Blueberry Buttons said that he had a fish, you know, like those, like like those cleaner fish a that like stuck it. on the. They stuck on the walls yeah. and stuff. Yeah. Well, he had a big one, and one day it was just gone, and then like years later, was it years later? He opened his bottom drawer. Like a year. Later, like a year later. It was the bottom it was, drawer. It was shriveled up in the bottom dead. drawer. No. Bottom of some clothes. <laughs> Oh, it like jumped out somehow. <laughs> yeah, I didn't drawer. admit it suicide. <laughs> it was disgusting. Yeah, it's it's like goldfish. Holy shit! Yeah, it, it had like it had those like buggy eyes that were super oh creepy. Oh so I was yeah. a young That's kid, so I wasn't fish. sad to see it go. You know what I mean? No, I. Um, this thing is fucking long, oh like seven, God. eight inches. Dang, yeah. seven, eight inches. Oh, wow. Gross. It's disgusting, though. It was creepy. It was some. creepy. Those are, those are I, one of the fish I didn't that like get them. big. Did big, it smell? Like, bigger the tank, the big thing will get big. I it's smelling, but it must have smelled after a year, <laughs> yeah. right? It's yeah, rotting yeah, in yeah, my drawer. There's got to be an intermediate oh. area there where the fish was stinking. Like. <laughs> yeah. Dude, I didn't smell it. It was Maybe dead. Maybe you keep yeah. gun in your underwear well, I was a kid, though. You're a smelly kid, for. you know. Who knows? That's true. Yeah. I got a good luck turtle story. Okay. That's an awesome to hear. Well, first, back in the day, I sprayed fruit also, though. Stinky turtle. Oh, well, I'll tell you. So... Um, oh, I was living in San Gabriel, um, you know, south of Pasadena, and uh, I was living in a guest house in 2012 behind like a Taiwanese family. They had a turtle that was just like in the back, in like okay. a, a cake, like a weird like glass like a fish aquarium, and um, uh, so I took this turtle out. It looked horrible. It was all green to the like lid and it was like just disgusting i thought this turtle was dead and i took him out and i like sprayed the hose on him and i'm like spraying the hose on him and i'm like okay this turtle's dead but i just want to clean it off maybe bury it or something wait why did you and why the, did you take the turtle out there? Is, it's your neighbor's turtle that you took it out of there <laughs> yeah so, so this is like i'm in a taking guest house these turtles out of their tank no. Oh, so I'm in a get i'm in a guest house yeah. like i'm in the back and uh like i'm next to the garage you know, Wait, but and, it's their uh, turtle. Why were you like thinking of bur burying it and stuff? Well, I, we, uh, my, one of my ex-wives was uh, really good friends with them, and they, I guess, she was talking to them, and they were like, "Just do whatever you want with that." And I'm like, "Yeah, it smells horrible." Well, why the would they tell you to deal with it? Wait, wait, wait. He's gonna replace I don't know. the turtle. Well, anyways, I'm really short. Yeah, no, I, I, I sprayed the water on the turtle, and it woke up. And I hadn't seen it. had been smelling like crazy <laughs> in the backyard. And I'm like, hey, Ja Ray, uh, why don't we fucking maybe talk to the, the land landlords and see what, what we can do with this? Because this is disgusting. And I thought the turtle was dead for sure. And it wasn't dead. Like, literally 30 minutes after in the sun, me spraying it with water, it... it <laughs> I was just sitting there, like, being a, a crazy person, just watering the lawn in the backyard, but also spraying him with water. It came alive, and I'm like, oh, it's my good luck turtle. Guess what? After that, I put in, like, this cool, like, aquarium type of deal, and I like, hooked him up and stuff, and I got, like, uh, I, that's when I met Brian in the ice house, uh, the the first time I ever met him. It was like right when I did that, like I fucking all of a sudden I'm getting commercial, commercial, commercial. Oh wow! Music video, music video, and I was like, oh, it's my good luck turtle. Nice. You know. So. So are you suggesting we should all clean turtles in order to 
<laughs> I don't know, dude. Yeah, I don't know. Right. Like, I got, Spring I got a couple herbs. other. I got like, I went to the Silvar uh, and uh, and got like three other little mini turtles that the like mm -hmm. Taiwanese people were selling. Like, they just had them like in their front shops. Yeah, and I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna get three more. Yeah, I'm gonna turtles. get three more. Get a whole squad, Ninja Turtles. You still have them? <laughs> yeah, I got a whole. <laughs> no, I don't. I had to actually. Um, I went through like. A, a divorce and then uh Are gave them to a friend and yeah it's a long story but no, I'm just um yeah but there's they're them. still alive they're still taking care of them. yeah, I them. <laughs> yeah I them all. i'm like i'm hungry i need some care well, I'm yeah no they're, they're still, still alive. alive yeah yeah they're still alive they're hanging out in a cool cool, cool little setup but anyways yeah i saw i add on to the fish story stuff <laughs> yeah, at least your turtles survived. Yeah, good luck turtles, man. I feel like there's, I don't know, <laughs> it's superstitious, Something but I'm it. like, man, yeah. fucking right after that happened, I got all the shit that happened to me. To which now I'm in VR, hanging out with you guys, because like I was doing all, all like the music jokes. videos. Yeah, and oh. I'm like <laughs> music videos, and then I'm like hanging out and meeting Brian. And uh, and then now, finally hanging out. How did this turn Brian into sentimental? What's going on? <laughs> What's cool, going man. on? Yeah. We're, we're not your turtles. Um, we're, we're not Brian. turtles. <laughs> we're, not, we're not replacing your turtles. <laughs> it was just Can awesome for me. I, I love fire. hanging out with all you guys. So <laughs> it was just great. So. I had, a fluff, I had a hamster named Fluffy, and my parents told me that we were having company over, so they told me to go put her in the garage, because, you know, hamster smell. And then after mm -hmm. the company left, um, I went out to go get her, and she was killed by rats. Whoa. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, I got a worse hamster story. I got a way worse hamster story. Wait, before you start, oh, I want to ask him. Hilarious, but terrible. No, 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 no. Did you see the carnage? <laughs> Yeah, I saw a carnage, and she was my oh, first shit. pet ever. So, so was sad. there like, I'm sorry. did they sad. eat all the stuff except for the bones or something? Mm, like her like guts were like ripped open, and like oh it's just like fur everywhere, and then just like pieces oh, like wait, like they a got piece of in arm. the cage. Yeah, somehow they got in the cage, like Vicious. the door. You know, the door yeah. is pretty easy to yeah. open, yeah. and so. Sweet. Yeah, yeah, they can. If their head they can fit them. through it, or is that cockroaches? I don't know. Uh, I'm sorry. Not, that's, I don't know. <laughs> but Damn. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> everyone, everyone really has a hamster Poor story. Fluffy. Go ahead, Bo. Yeah. Yeah. So, well, well so me, me and my brothers, we lived in Southern California. Uh, we had hamsters, first pets as well. Uh, somehow they <laughs> escaped in our fucking neighbors. I swear to God, they broke their legs, broke hamsters' legs, and like let them just die your neighbors, neighbors broke their legs my neighbor, yeah they're like chill like little kids like or, like it was oh slightly older gosh. than me and my brothers wow. but like yeah yeah oh, real crazy stories. Stories. yeah they like murdered our, our, our yeah oh what our weirdos oh murdered your pet what are they doing asses. now oh uh, shit, I, fucking I, I, fuck if i know i haven't seen them oh, since 93 the they're wow. serial killers well i do i actually weirdos. have another story like that so, oh, yeah. so a friend in high school, his little sister is like kind of mental. He already knew something was wrong with her. And she like, they had a pet rabbit. And apparently she like kicked the rabbit to death <gasps> and like hung it by its ears onto a coat what? hanger no. and left it in what? the closet. What the heck? That's what? Uh, As you do. Yeah. And then for like, fun. I don't know what happened. I don't, for fun. <laughs> yeah. That girl is a I don't serial really killer. Oh, talk. Jesus. Yeah. And after that, I remember yeah, they, they were, like put her in a lot of therapy, but I don't really talk to them now or anything. But... <laughs> what, what was she doing yeah. now? So well, fucked up. I don't know. I'm that mm. like my friend. I he's like one of those random Facebook friends that I, you randomly talk teacher. to, but I haven't peered into wow. his like life to see Weird. if his sister is still around. Yeah. Now, not to not to one up that, but I do have a <laughs> terrible hamster story. What's wrong with people? Okay. <laughs> 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 also in high school, so we're we're dancing also to a similar time frame. Uh, in high school, uh -huh. or at least junior high, I can't remember. Uh, one of my best friends, he had two hamsters. One of the hamsters killed his other hamster, 
like in cold blood. And, <laughs> they do and, that. <laughs> yeah, oh, and, and, and I, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna involve myself in this, but it was decided that there was gonna be an execution. <laughs> and... <laughs> that is such a high school oh, thing to do. Do so <laughs> yeah, right. they well, punish him? How did you do it? Swift justice. Well, so you guys know hamster balls, right? You know. Yes. Like the ball and then also a firecracker. Oh no! <laughs> okay, that's pretty <laughs> fucked up. Yeah, yeah. It, it, was, it was very, very traumatic for everybody. Uh, yeah, <laughs> because it didn't do the job. But kind of it funny. Didn't do the job at first. Oh, it didn't. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So they had to <laughs> stop it to do it. <laughs> he just yeah, imitated it. What was it doing? Yeah. Oh, I don't yeah. know if it was blow this, but it was, it was, it was, like, <laughs> it was pretty it was pretty bad. <laughs> yeah. Poor we don't like to talk about that one much, my friend. Eye but for it an happened. eye. It happened. Yeah, it was, yeah. It was kind of I mean like they killed the other oh one. Oh my god, I hope you guys never become hamsters in your next life. <laughs> yeah. I mean you probably <laughs> will now. <laughs> Not my hamster. I yeah, just, you I probably just suggest any ideas. I was I was on the kill your friend. I'm not gonna live your life ten hamsters in the incident of being an observer. I mean, I didn't say you no, better. Like, so I guess Nuremberg trial excuse. Uh, Did, <laughs> so you had an execution. Did you have like, like a trial and like? Did you read it? Yeah. <laughs> Did you have like a no, ritual? I mean, the, the evidence was pretty clear. I mean, it was, you know, it was, yeah, yeah, it was, it was brutal. It was, you better be a good hamster in your next not, life. Not, not a problem. Well, You're I, probably gonna well, die a horrible death. Again, not my hamster. Yeah. Not my hamster. Not my not my call. I was just there. Oh, just my to... cheeks hurt. <laughs> oh, I didn't light the fuse. <laughs> you right there, just a spectator. I, yeah, yeah, I didn't do any of that. Uh, yeah. They all held you the lighter witness. together. But but yeah, you enjoyed it, didn't enjoyed you? It. Yeah, you did. I, did. I didn't enjoy it. I was present. I, 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 yeah. Did you I, laugh? I uh, I mean, like at first it was like, haha, yeah, we're gonna kill this hamster, and then it was like, oh, shit. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! And then it was like, oh shit, we're gonna kill this hamster. Yeah, I mean, like you know, you don't you don't consider like the life of it until it's like twitching in the hamster ball. Yeah. Wait, what kind of firecracker? Oh, 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 no. Yeah, was it a caliber, big M80? It was, it was not, not an M80. It was not, not enough. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Not <laughs> enough. Oh, oh, I, did have a, oh, I did have a guinea pig, and like one night, I was like, one not one night, one day I was taking a nap, and I heard her name was Judy, and she like ran around her cage, and I think she choked on a pellet and died. When I was sleeping, <laughs> and so like, so like I took her little body and I went and I was like, in college I didn't have a shovel. I was living in like dorms or something, and then I went under the stairs and, and like buried a, or, like dug a grave with a rock, <laughs> and I didn't dig it deep enough. So like the next oh, no. day, I found like the box that I buried her in and like pieces of her on the ground because oh. like raccoons oh, dug her oh, up yeah, and stuff <laughs> well she yeah. went back to dead. nature yeah, yeah i figured that but i tried to life. rebury it <laughs> poor little yeah. judy she seems you think enough. about it why the fuck don't mm -hmm. humans let animals eat their dead corpses? some of them do they do some what? cultures yeah like in um oh, nepal really? yeah they do that. They carry they the feed body them back up to the vultures. Yeah, they carry mm -hmm. them up the mountain, let the body be taken by the vultures. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's pretty, pretty interesting because that, yeah. like, uh, you know, it's recycling. Yeah, I'd rather have it that yeah. way. They're, yeah, they're and it's like uh, without uh, blood and bone. Human compost, no right? Grow. Yeah. I, I I saw a thing on a video, right? Aren't they trying to do that in Washington? Where they put well, you in some, some sort of like uh, mushroom box. There's, there's like some oh, graveyards yeah, or cemeteries where they just bury you like in a bag or or a cardboard box, and it's and like it's just native plants around you. It's really not like anything marked. No big giant headstones. Just like one little marker that you know where mm -hmm. you would be buried. At. But yeah. Yeah. I think they were. And it's kind of nice. Calling, yeah, this this one thing that was like similar to that, but but it was like a, a organic cremation, and then after so many months, they can go back 
and then there's not much left of you or something. I'm not Organic sure. Organic cre mm. cremation. What's that? I, I don't know. I have to look it up. And sometimes I have you watched that those videos of uh, Ask a Mortician? She was talking about it. Uh, anyway, I don't like that lady, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what lady? Well, she was talking about. She advocates for natural uh, burial, but mm. but hers it was like they put you in this box and they leave you in there for like six months or something, and then they take you out, and then there's like. You become fertilizer, like organic mm. material, like soil. And then you can put the soil like with a tree or a plant oh, or yeah. something like that. That's a new thing too. Like, oh, you can put your loved one under a tree and then they're that tree now or something. Or put a seed. Yeah, they the... had that too. It's just interesting yeah. different options as opposed to where they just cremate you and they fire you up. And yeah. it takes a lot of fuel to right, turn oh. you into ash. So. I like yeah. uh, what they did in, uh, I think, Italy or something, where it's like the catacombs of bones and the whole fucking place is just made out of human bones and skulls. France. It goes for like a wow. hundred miles. France. I've never been to it, but I've seen it on YouTube. Huh. Oh, yeah. The, the, the French catacombs? I want to be, <laughs> I wanna be cremated and like thrown out the car door window yeah, like when you're driving <laughs> so that like people behind you know? Just, just hey, get the fuck out of my way! <laughs> <laughs> Coats windshields. Put their windshield wipers on. <laughs> yeah, straight in their ear filter. <laughs> Gross. Well, people I was talking with my sister. I was saying you could do a, a cheap bombs, cremation right? And then just spread my ashes. I, we talked about that before at like my mom's grave or some of my other relatives' graves. Mm -hmm. You know, you could do it that way. Hey, it's not that cheap either. I mean, yeah, it's I... relatively cheap compared to a regular like put it in the coffin. It's cheaper kind of thing. than burial. Yeah, but burial dude, it's still like eight hundred like... bucks. Yeah, yeah but it's barely. cheaper than like Kim. twelve to fifteen thousand yeah. dollars. I want to do what yeah. Kim has, you know, in the why. <laughs> Like, if I die, like, I want to just, you know, be cremated and, like, just thrown out on the edge of uh, Oahu somewhere, yeah. you know. Like a Hawaiian wedding, you know, where they go out on the surfboards, hang out, you know. Oh, paddle like out. Like yeah, paddle Let's out. Put you inside you know. a fire crocker. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> just blow you up somewhere. Yeah, that'd be kind of cool. No, yeah. No, yeah. Well, you, uh, you have to have some good relatives or friends that will actually do that, right? So you don't end up just yeah. like in a box somewhere. Well, I hope I hope I can get to that point in my life for sure. <laughs> I we hope won't that I can have some people. About you. <laughs> yeah, Kim, come on! <laughs> don't forgive me. Can you? I so I don't give a shit what happens to my car. body after I die. Yeah, we won't care. We're dead right, <laughs> at that point. Maybe to I science, if like it's still good. Right? Oh. I want to get all my tattoos like stretched and dried out and framed and give oh, them to all my family gross. members. Oh, and then I want my body to go to a body them? farm. <laughs> What's a body no, farm? No, but that's fine. Uh, a body farm <laughs> is my, where uh, they it's into a guitar. It's like oh, science, yeah. and then oh. they take your body and they like put it out into a field, or they do whatever to study like sure. decomposition and and stuff like that, like mm -hmm. what your body would do. Over time, you take like an iron and then take the tattoos and put them on some t-shirts, you know. But do you want? Yeah. Do you want? Do you want <laughs> the last part of your funeral to be on the shirt, like the the Hawaiian want... funeral? No, I just want yeah. all my framed tattoos given to my front friends and family, but, whether but, they like I mean, it or but not. After that, after <laughs> like that, tanned like, and I mean, leather. After that, you're gonna do. Sure. Yeah, tanned. Yeah, you know, like stretched. A, yeah. Do you... Yeah, I mean, sure. That, it like, doesn't matter. Frame on a How felt that cost? That must cost some money, right? Yeah, I looked that. it up. It costs <laughs> about, depending on the size of the tattoo, it costs oh. a few thousand dollars. You could smell it. But there it. is somebody wow, who does so, uh... it. You could smell it after. <laughs> <You could> smell <laughs> it. Yeah, it's like jerky. <laughs> I mean, leather smells good. good. Oh my it. god. <laughs> <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Flavor it with some so wine and sauce. With dead bodies, if they started no, using no added MSG. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, it so grow mushrooms in you. Yeah. Oh, they they have. I, I saw this thing recently where they make a coffin out of mycelium mushrooms, and they're natural mm. recyclers. So they naturally take your body and create like 
return it back to the soil. And yeah, um, yeah old mushrooms I'd be can into it. Old, old mushrooms grow mycelium because oh. it's like their root network. Yeah. It's like an internet. But they It's like a good way to go. Yeah. yeah. But they it's it's biodegradable, environmentally friendly, and they they just take some mushrooms, blend it up with some sawdust, and let it grow in this plastic coffin mold. And then it's like pretty solid. And you could be stopping world hunger, like with your dad. You wanna go yeah. here? Yeah, yeah, let's go. Oh. Cool, man. It's Japan Street. Do you see something you on your it? top left? Like a join thing? Nope. I mean, bottom left. Turn on the day? Uh, That's cool. This little guy uh, follows you. So many options. Oh, this guy? Hi. The mom. Oh, hi, And the baby. Good bus. Get on the bus. <laughs> oh, get on, on the bus. Get on the bus. Get yeah. on the on bus. Yeah. You know how to drive? Show yeah. a license. <laughs> drive the bus. The bus license. I think, I think we're, we all need to sit down, otherwise, we'll probably clip through the bus. There's no seatbelts. Take a seat, Mark. Encom, watch out. Oh, Encom's. Encom got arrested. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh no, this is gonna make me motion sick. Oh no. I like this one. This, this is really cool. Though. Was he not sitting down? No. Rip. Alright, we're stopping. <laughs> Look at that one. That's a fancy one. On the bus. Wait, 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 wait for it. Wait for Don't move. Once you click it, don't move. <laughs> Are you actually driving this? this no. Oh, it's going. I'm here. I don't know everybody else. There's no traffic. Turn behind me. Hey, Kim. Back at the bus. White band, white band. Ten o'clock, ten o'clock. Okay, who wants to get on another vehicle? Where's NCOM? Oh, there you go. Thank you. All right, Kim's out. Bye, Kim. What's the fastest vehicle in this? Oh, my truck. Alright, I'm this out. This feels like being on a real bus where it pulls the shit out of you. you know? <laughs> yeah. I, I kind of like bus rides, though. You like bus rides? Wow, it, it just drops I, us off yeah. in the middle of fucking you know, you know what I want to do? It depends where you go. Like, um... That, uh, snow ride, like in, uh, Let's Switzerland cross. or whatever in the, in the yeah, winter. Like, like, it's a train ride. Mm. And you can, like, you know, just hang out and have fun. Oh, like the recreational I don't know if you've ever train rides. Yeah, it's like a yeah, it's like a long train ride. But yeah, you know, you just hang out and there's like tons of am amenities. And yeah, I want I want to go on those. Like a fancy train ride, you know those nice ones where it's like, oh, what the fuck, glitching. Yeah, yeah, it was glitching. It was glitching. There you go. Yep. Yeah. 
I'm glitching. Or I was. Yeah. Wait, it just ends here. The okay, I'm I'm starting to get car sick. I'm gonna. I'm going upstairs. Bye, guys. See you, Turk. Bye, bye. See ya. This is like one of those dilapidated, abandoned apartment buildings. I don't think it's worth exploring. Yeah, probably not. Hey, Brian's oh. gonna go to bed. Bye, guys. Okay. All right. I'll see Good you. To see see you Take care. Good night. Good night. Um, shit. I'll see you both. I guess. Uh, <laughs> is he yeah, finding anything cool about this world? Uh, I mean, there's, there's, there's a lot of stuff around, but um, nothing What's spectacular, yeah. as far as I can tell. Okay. I like that that avatar. That